So, uh, you guys ready for my racing gaming origin story? <clears throat> You're probably more ready than I am, because I don't think I am either. <sighs> Folks, welcome to a very, very special version of Hot Race Car Nights. Hello, everyone. Welcome back once again. And, oh boy, tonight's a good one. Tonight's going to be a really fucking good one. Let me just check the levels here. Yeah, we're all good. Super Mike is here. Hello. Preston is here. Currently at work, but I'll start watching afterwards. Hang out when you can. Um, I think Nay might be around at some point as well, wielding the sword of moderation. But, um... <sighs> just gonna enjoy the music for a little bit. Actually, I already have been. L literally. Um, Nay is literally around. Yeah, there he is. Thought so. Um... Let me know if all the levels are good, obviously. Should be fine. I posted first the second we went live. You posted so quickly, Streamlabs isn't even showing it, Nay. It's like the retro lounge combined with hot race car night. Yes, this is a hot retro race car night in the lounge, basically. Um, and the reason for that is very simple. Um, like, I obviously, I like to leave a lot of the retro games for Nay, of course, but sometimes there are going to be exceptions, and I thought this one was definitely an exception for Hot Race Car Nights, because this is the first ever, ever racing game I ever played in my life. This is it. This is my origin story of racing gaming. It was this, and it was Super Hang On, another Mega Drive game. Hot Retro Nights. Yes, we'll go with that. This is a Hot Retro Night right here. Does that mean it'll be... Now you can do a Nays Race Car Lounge. <laughs> we'll, do, we'll do like a crossover episode. Cross the streams. Hey, nay has gone for it as well. But, um... Yeah, the first console I ever owned was a Mega Drive, of course. And this was the first racing game I had for it. This was one of the first... Four or five games I had for it. I had Sonic the Hedgehog 1. This. FIFA Soccer 95. Um, Monopoly on Mega Drive, bizarrely, and PGA Tour Golf 2. <laughs> and I have almost all of those back again, because I did actually get rid of my Mega Drive when I was, like, early teens. And then before I was, like, uh, 16 or something, I remember I was like, no, I need a Mega Drive again in my life. And I got this one, and it's been with me ever since. Um, stop stealing my <laughs> A retro racer. Hello, LP. And James Carmoni's here. Hi, the usual gang is here. Um, so yeah, this is a game. This is it. This is fucking it. I spent hours, so much time playing this. Played the single player, played the multiplayer with my dad. It's one of the few games, because my parents are pretty crap at games in general. They're not really gamers, fair enough. They enjoyed playing Medal of Honor, the first Medal of Honors on PS1, mainly because they could just sort of wave their guns around and accidentally shoot Nazis in the penis, which was hilarious. Um, because they had a sort of uh, animation with all like, my nutsack! Well, not in that voice, obviously. It was like, ow, my nutsack! Or something. Um, <laughs> but this was one of the few games they dared to play me on multiplayer app. Because it had to have a fairly equal chance of winning. Um, except one level, which hopefully we'll get to at some point, where I always used to completely screw my dad out of the win. <laughs> so, <laughs> my nutsack. Nick's here. My first destruction, uh, first racing game is Destruction Derby 64. Good choice. That's a good one. Um, what's nice about this game is that it is most, mostly a multiplayer game, obviously. Micro Machines has always been. So you get two-player party play, which is where you can... I think there was a way that if you had two controllers, you could share the controls. So the cars would automatically accelerate. And so for, you'd have two players per controller. So there's a Mega Drive controller. Uh, on the D-pad... You could use, I think, up and down to accelerate and brake, and then left and right to turn. And then on the other side, you used A and C to turn, and B to brake. Which I think was really innovative. Test Drive 5. Oh, good shout. <laughs> Wonder Boy Tom, you got knocked the fuck out, man. Yeah, that was all. I remember I woke up after a night of, um, well, a fun night, shall we say, over at uh, Loading Bar Stratford. I woke up and I saw that clip on Instagram, and I was like... They put Roman Reigns over strong. Thank you, Anthony Pettis, for putting that over strong. Um, 
But yeah, I was saying how it's nice that this game has a lot of multiplayer, but it does have a very good single player. So, obviously, that's what we're going to explore tonight. So, here we go. Here's the four kinds of single player you can do. There's challenge mode, which we'll get to in a minute. Head to head. Fairly obvious. You against one CPU opponent. Super League, which I really did like. Not to be confused with the Rugby League competition of the same name. And time trial. Fairly self-explanatory. Um... So before we get going, I'm going to do challenge mode first. So we'll basically run through these modes as they go. Uh, before we get going, let's do the housekeeping that I normally forget to do until about a minute before the end of the stream. Uh, if you are new around here, please do uh, follow us so you can uh, follow us on Twitch so you can see when we go live next. Uh, also subscribe to us on YouTube. That is where all our VODs go. And we have exclusive Friday videos over there as well. The Bad Games Beatdown, Plays Videos and the Challenge Belt series. If you're feeling particularly generous, you can subscribe to us on Twitch. You can also pledge to us. There's a Streamlabs donation link down there in the Twitch description. None of that is mandatory. If you fancy being generous and you like what we do, that's all it is. Um, I'm not even going to try and guilt you this week and say it's my birthday in a couple of days, so that's why you should do it. Um, so, that's all the good stuff, isn't it? Oh, yeah, follow us on the socials. Twitter, uh, at Armbar Arcade. Ironic, given that I've just quit Twitter. <laughs> So Nay's in charge of that for the moment, and we've also got a Facebook page and, um, and stuff like that. So let's get down to it, shall we? Let's fucking do this. I'm just glad that the game's working, to be honest. This is one of those Mega Drive games, and Nay will, Nay will understand this. This is one of those Mega Drive games where you have to... I'm just going to sit back a bit. There we go. Where you have to, like, if you have to get it at the exact right angle, the cartridge in the exact right angle in the slot for it to work... Uh, FIFA Soccer 95 is the worst one for that for me. It would take like 20 goes for me to get that game working sometimes. Luckily, this one only took three. Hopefully, all the levels are coming through. It might be coming through mono in terms of the game audio. Uh, that's just because Mega Drive composite cables and things like that. I had several Micro Machine sets as a kid. That's nice. <laughs> you can send us links. Hey, thank you, James. We are very proud of how good the Bad Games Beatdown is. Oh my god. I think I had the NASCAR truck that did that, Super Mike. I also had the Speedway. Do you remember there was an actual NASCAR oval when it had four lanes and these four cars? Uh, and it, it had like a thing where you'd wind it up and they'd go pew, 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 and fire around. Like 0.5 second laps. It's NASCAR Year 3000 edition. But it was good fun. And I, I think if I remember right, it had a little drag, drag strip up the middle. And like a working pit lane? Working pit road? That thing was boss. I love that. Um, yeah, I was big into micro machines as a kid. I was one of those kids that had micro machine sets, Hot Wheels sets, Skelectric sets, fucking everything. It was all good. Um, ooh, okay. Uh, I might look into that in a bit. Uh, if the audio is an issue, if it's, if it's bugging you, then please do tell me. But, uh, for the moment it seems okay. Right, let's pick a character, shall we? We've got mm, some people. Anchonk there. We've got Anchonky Boy Walter. Uh... <laughs> Volta Progress Wrestling uh, World Champion. Jeremy, who <laughs> just looks like a uh, Tory. Uh, her. Adi I always picked Adina for some reason. She just seemed cool. This man here, who is... Um, oh, fuck. What's the Billy Idol? The Billy Idol wannabe over here. Uh, Maria, who fancies doing some dancing. Jethro. <laughs> uh, the kind of, you know, Rasta guy there. Cherry. She's like, yeah. She's like Penelope Pitstop from... Um, Wacky races. And Dwayne. Be Volta. <laughs> uh, is that Garage Nation? Is that... I'm trying to look over at the screen here. But, um. Most current generation games of diarrhea. There are plenty of good ones, in fairness. Violet Berlin. <laughs> right. Bruno. Look at him there. His wife beater. And look at Spider there. That absolute grease monkey there. Chen. We've got Delora. Davey. I don't know what he's doing there. He's just like, hey, hello. He's air drumming on the dashboard. Um, Emile's just like, hey, um, um, hi. Lisa's just like, hello. She looks like a sort of white suburban mom who's like flirting with you while her kids are at school. Uh, we're going to be Anchonk Volta. Yes, but we're going to change the name, if I remember rightly. So, um... oh, hang on. What, what am I doing? I just called him a chonky boy, and... Chonk, will it fit? Chonk, it fits! Chonk! There we go. Right, Chonk is off. We've got the training camp. Challenge race one. So I guess, I think challenge mode is a set of uh, races. Where you have three attempts each time to get through. By, I think, winning? 
I think you have to win to advance. So here we go. It's nice. Get out of the way. I'm the red ATV. Uh, and you can tell this is the first first race because, um, oh dear. It's kind of easy. <laughs> the difficulty level does spike murderously quickly. And there we go. <laughs> I like that feature. If you went fast enough around the first lap, you could just win. Like the game would just go, oh, fuck it, you're dominating. This. You don't need to complete the race. You're obviously going to win. Can you imagine if F1 races were like that? Five laps in, it's like, yeah, just finish it there. Merc Lewis Hamilton's going to win, so fuck it. But then we wouldn't have the joy of Kerbal Villain Lager. Dave from Games Master. It's the earliest version of Pro Street dominating. <laughs> yes, that is it. We'll go with that. All right, now we're on to the sort of DIY theme level. So I remember rightly, given that it's called Driller Killer. Has some drills. Oh my god. I survived falling off my pixel. Oh, running over some nails there. And it's basically an oval. Yep. And there we go. <laughs> So I've won two races by completing two laps. This was a bit tougher, if I remember rightly. Beach buggies at the beach. Kind of to be expected. Oh, really? That's awesome, Super Mike. Where we go? Out the way. Oh, hang on. Yes! I forgot. Oh, that was close. I forgot that in this game you could honk the horn. Yes, because even though there's barely any buttons on the Mega Drive controller... I was like, accelerate, brake, honk your horn obnoxiously. Those are the only things you need to do in a racing game, isn't it? Oh, God. Oh, it's making me have to do the rest of the race. That's no fun. Oh. If I remember rightly, when you go over those, like, sand bridges, if you go close to the edge, the sand falls away, so it tries to catch you out. Oh. Someone else just finished. Well, not finished. I like the fact you can hear. There you go. That's the noise you make when you cross the finish line. Can you hear out? Oh, we're lapping someone. You absolute embarrassment. Yeah, there you go. You hear the noise when uh, the other cars go across the start finish line. That's quite nice. Ah, there we go. I mean, what was the point of making me do that race? Drifty! <laughs> yes, there's a lot of drifty in this game. The handling model is so nice. It's, lo it's like sort of early driver physics, it's very arcadey, obviously. But it's very drifty. You can get it going. Ah, this was a nice thing. Because you have three... It's you ha it's a lives-based system to try and complete each race. But sometimes you can get the chance to earn extra lives by doing this. Collect 30 micro-machines, they say. You mean run them over. Whoops. It's been a long time since I've done this one. The difficult thing with this one is that you have no idea... It's kind of freeform, so you have no idea where where the next car is going to show up. And sometimes in the later editions, it gets really cruel. Do, 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 do. There we go. Come on, come on. There we go. Three seconds to spare. We'll maybe give you an extra life if you can complete this incredibly difficult challenge. Is that a macro machine or just a machine? It's a nano, no. It's a smallish machine. Meaty machine. Meaty micro. Okay, here we go. We're here for the Pinball Table Grand Prix. This is a new addition by Liberty Media to the calendar. And Smash and Vettel's out in front, having pulverized the Red Bull of um, Max. Where's the track go? Oh, my God. Okay, these cars are really fast. So, oh, and you've got to avoid the um, flip. And I've won. <laughs> okay, so apparently I didn't dominate the last race enough. But that one, I did. All right, so now it's time for the Jeff Cobb Challenge. Yeah, back when monster truck racing was just driving over cars. Now they have to do all sorts of other shit. Basically be Tony Hawk with four massive wheels or I'm not interested. Nope. Right, those spinning corns on the cob. Making me quite hungry, actually. I haven't had dinner before the stream. But I'm in the lead. Oh, no, I'm not. Get out of the way. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Oi! The blue truck fucking punted. Oh, no! <laughs> Bollocks! All right, we're not getting a domination bonus. We're really not getting a domination bonus this time, are we? Right, okay, let's focus. I'll get cocky. There we go. 
The others want a shortcut. We'll do the same. There we go. Right, green truck is just terrible. Get out of the way, you peanut. What are you doing here? You do, do, do. Right, avoid the food. Don't get distracted by the food. It's easy to do. I fucking love corn on the cob. Right. Do, do, do. Right. And you got to, because they're rotating, you got to, there you go. Let be careful. Right, there's second place. You bang, mate. Imagine if that was the finish for the win. Right. Yeah, up to second. Can we still pull off the win? Or will we immediately lose the extra life we just gained? Where is the leader? Oh, fuck. Oh, that was close. Where is the leader? We've still not caught him up. Fucking hell, the leader was fast. Oi, you! Just yelling at him. Oi, you prick. You cheat. You hacks. Oh, I've qualified. Okay, finishing top two was enough. Right, that's okay. The referee's a wanker. I should probably just open the... No, not BBC Sport. Uh, the Twitch. There you go. Right, so that's okay. We don't lose uh, a life for that. Because, of course, this is old school gaming. So we do it lives based. 105 followers on the Armbar Arcade Twitch. That is so lovely. It's so cool. Right. Do this. Aha. This is a attic based track. I nearly said layout. You're not at the Model Railway Expo anymore. I was actually at um, Big Model Railway Expo at um, Ali Pally over the weekend. <laughs> Still remember how to troll the AI. <laughs> oh, good times. I like the fact that as the game goes on... It, oh, I forgot that's what I did. Shit. There we go. We're good. Good. Give me a speed boost. There you go. <laughs> and I do love trolling the AI. Especially when, later on when they get cheap as fuck and they are like... Stupidly faster than you in a straight line. Okay, go along. That one is the clue. I like the fact they give you little visual cues as to where when a turn's coming up. Like for example, I'll show you on the final lap. They, there you go. Like the boards look a bit different. There'll be a different shaped board. There you go. That one's cut off, and that's a sign that you're gonna. So look, there are all the boards are going across. That one's cut off, which means there's a turn coming up. So as soon as you see the style of the boards change, there you go. There's another one. I'm oh, gone. Send it. Drag race the. Oh. <laughs> Get some cheap shots in after the bell. I'm like fucking. Uh, what's her name? Jermaine Durand to me. Holly Holmes just watching this because I view protesting. All right. Well, Bruno wins. Tonk uh, and Tonk is second, which is still enough. Garage game. Oh, this was a good one. This was where the game got kind of meta. Because this track set on a kid's playset. It's out the way. Also, this one's bizarrely, like, zoomed out. So all the cars are even smaller. Oh, the red blobs have punted the yellow blob. Oh, there's blobs of oil on the track for some reason. Obviously, the kid who's playing with this has spilled some ink on the track for some reason. Mommy, what if I use that pot of ink on your desk to simulate oil on the track? Yay! No! Hesketh, don't do that! It's quite a middle-class family that we're uh, driving around the toy set of at the moment. Doop. There we go. I like the fact it just it, it just goes full meta. Like, well, the real Micro Machines toys come with their own, like, play sets and that. So let's just have a circuit built around a play set. I used to do this. It used to be... It wasn't Micro Machines stuff because it was, like, Hot Wheels size. There were those sets that were, like, city streets and that. And I used to build, like, road circuits around there. But I'd have to have wider sections, because most of the time they were just wide enough for one car. So I'm like, well, this is even worse than Monaco. Like that. I did complete Sonic 06 Part 1 finale. <laughs> Holy shit, that front flip. I don't even know what... Oh! We're back in the ATVs. Ground Force, the reboot. Oh, this one's got jumps. Oops. I also love the contact physics in this game. You can actually punt the AI. So many racing games, you just try and punt the AI and they don't move. Which, you know, is fair enough. It's a way of trying to deter cheating by just punting the AI off. But I still like games where they allow you to do it because that's realistic. If I try and turn an AI car, they should respond, not just go, we're not going to move. Gran Turismo games are kind of guilty for that. 
Oh, punt. Get out of the way. Oh, look at this. Quite a close battle pack. Get out of the way. Oi. You f <laughs> this was a game where you could feasibly fuck over the AI. And I love that. Whoops. Tried to time the punt on that yellow. Uh what? That, that is some brutal track limits rules right there. No, fuck you. We're just going to respawn you back down there. You cheat. Alright, okay. Come back is on again. Oh, they're, they're getting into it. Yeah, I are super aggressive as well, which I like. Right, both of you. <laughs> both of you out the way. Quite inconsistent with the track limits, isn't it? Allow me to do that, but... Not oh, three wide for the lead. Three wide for the lead. The green the green quad. ATV something. Bike. Tried sneaking through. But Red is back in the lead. I.e. me. Oops. Avoid the flowers of doom. Right. No. Would you like to play a game? Can we get him in the water? Can we get... Yes! <laughs> This was burnout before burnout was a thing. Take down. Oh, the green bike's seen that and he's like, Oi, I will avenge Yellow's death. <laughs> no, you're not, because I'm out of here. I've had my fun for this race. We're going to lock this shit down. Now, there were sort of hidden collectibles in some of these tracks, like extra lives and stuff. <laughs> to honk the horn in celebration. Um, but the only one I ever found was one where you had to basically go the wrong way on one of the tracks and find an extra life. So it was almost guaranteed that you then lose the race. For the love of God, get some RGB cables. Does it, does it look alright? Supremacy MMA completes the memes. We've been through this, James. That game is not banter. It's tedious. Different engine sounds for each vehicle. So it's better than Gran Turismo 6. <laughs> Or NFS Shift 2 with the AI dickheads. That doesn't look too bad, does it, Cam? I think it's okay. Let me know if it's alright. Right, lights out. Another uh, attic one. Oh no, this is down in the basement now. Okay. <laughs> oh my god, if I remember rightly in this one, one of the AI is actually faster. Yeah, look at that! The blue cars in this race is actually faster in a straight line. Oi! No! No! Oh, fuck! No! Bollocks! Come back! Yes! Go on! Get it! Oh! Get, yes! He's shitting the turns! Right, come on, we can do this! Oh my god, look how much faster he is! Later on, most of the AI are that fast. Oh god, I forgot there was a chicane! No! Alright, stay calm. Stay calm, AJ. You can do this. I have beaten this guy before. I don't think we're gonna do this time. Unless we get the perfect... Ow! We're not. <laughs> yeah, we're not going to win this one. Never mind. Second will do. I think that's why they randomly throw this one at you early. Alright, well, Dwayne wins with his Hax engine. Oh, one of my favourite ones. One of the favourite levels of mine. The snooker table with sports cars. AA... But basically, well, at the time this game came out, be Group C. So, Cam, this is for you. LMP1 cars. Yeah. Oh, God. On a snooker table. Actually, a pool table, I think. Do you know, I actually, for some, somehow, I actually came across, I think my dad found it somewhere. Or got given to him. This busted up old little uh, snooker table. It was like a tiny snooker table. But I spent more time driving, uh, playing with toy cars on it than actually playing snooker with it. Whoops. Where's the turn? Oh, we're just going all the way around. Fuck it. Ah, uh, you can't keep up with me, can you? It's possible what it's like to be Toyota in the World Endurance Championship. Oops. Oh, they've tried to sneak past. And I think you just saw there that there was a... Being... It, it's an active snooker... Ta it's an active pool table, which... Oops. Which means there are some balls flying around sometimes. There's one variant of this style of track where you're on a snooker table, and I think as you drive onto a straight, someone hits a... Oh, I think someone's just been wrecked by a snooker ball somewhere. A pool ball, whatever. Um, someone's just been squashed by balls. So, someone's king, I'm sure. Um, let's just not think about it. But yeah, there is one variant of this level where... Or this type of track. There you go, you see that red ball there? It was just lurking. It was just waiting. Waiting to crush my dreams. But hey, it was like... Red ball meets red car. I see you there. I got you, buddy. But yeah, there is one version of this track where you go onto a straight... Oh, bollocks. You go onto a straightaway and someone goes to pot a... Hit a cue ball behind you. So the ball's like chasing you down. 
It's kind of like those levels in Crash Bandicoot where there's like a boulder right behind you. <laughs> oh, there we go. So we should win this one easily. This is being like, this is like being Toyota at Le Mans. Oops. <laughs> Including fucking it on the penultimate corner. <laughs> Including fucking it on the last lap. But never mind. Unlike Toyota, we still win. Purple pool table. Definitely the 90s. Fuck yeah. Shift 2A made me smash a controller because I got cheated on the last straight of an almost hour long in Europe. Yeah. The Shift 2 AI are fucking brutal, man. Wine on. <laughs> Always like being back on Twitter. Uh, right. I never remember the names. Fuck it. Right, this is another uh, dinner table themed level. With construction trucks. Or dump trucks, whatever. <laughs> Someone clip that, plus. Just a light, light nudge on the back of the blue truck. And he was like, oh no! Oh fuck, the leader's crashed. I've crashed. What is going on? Oh my god. And somehow I'm in the lead having not passed anyone. Oh, the yellow truck's coming back though. Oh, look at that. We're level in a straight line. So we are equal equal cars. Equal pace. Oh, he's tried shortcutting the sneaky bastard. Oi! You. Do some thrift do for a wine stain there. Well, I always thought it was wine. It may have been ketchup. Over a dinner mat. Imagine if you were actually at dinner at someone's house. And they're like, uh, excuse me, are there supposed to be little cars having a race around the dinner table? Yeah, that's just what they do. <laughs> it's like the dog sitting under the seat hoping to try and eat some of your dinner. Oh, the yellow truck's just fucked that turn. Oh, he's gone for the shortcut again. Oi. It's fucking yellow truck, man. He's hacks. <clears throat> right, come back here. I'm having that. Why is it with the yellow trucks being really fast in this, uh, this mode? Yeah, fuck you, mate. I can... Oops. <laughs> I can corner cut like the best of them and also slide in wine. I'm pretty sure Daigo Saito does not have to deal with that. Oh, in the first D1 event of the year, there's going to be some interesting conditions out on track as Daigo Saito has to deal with a spilled glass of wine on the track. Well, I guess the level's called Wine On, so there you go. Where is the yellow truck? What's going on? Fuck it, I'm taking a short... Okay, <laughs> I'm fucking up a shortcut. I think there's another one you can do if you're good. So, I think it's up here. Ye yes, there we... Oh, no, come on. I oh, I thought they used to allow that. Oh, never mind. Oop, oops. Boing, boing. The track limit gods... Oh, go on. Another shortcut. Yellow truck's gaming the system, man. Oh, this is hacks. I protest. I'm putting in a protest with the league. You cheat. Cheat, 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 cheat. Oh, no, he's clipped it. Why did I leave Twitter? Is it because it can be cancerous? Yes. <laughs> it basically really fucks with my mental health really badly. 700% slower than Jason. <laughs> Nay and Cam both went for the same clip. Well done, lads. Like it. But, um, yeah, no, Twitter was just getting pretty toxic for me. I just, I, like, it became an addic addictive thing. I was just like, oh, I'm just going to go on Twitter. So it spends 20 minutes spiraling into a misery pile of depression and FOMO and... We're all going to die. What is the point? <laughs> so I was just like, why don't I just not do that? So there we go. Right, this one is a DIY themed uh, level in the sort of Jaguar XK. Oh, no. Um, I'm trying to think what kind of car that is. Oh, it's a TVR. Kind of looks like a TVR. Twitter is the hell site forevermore. Yeah. At least on Instagram, it's just pictures. So you're just like, oh, that's nice. Some food. Dog. And beach and something, a flat lay of someone's bullet journal, Pfft, whatever. And here we go. But yeah, I said this was like a DIY level because, yeah, it's literally doing the wallpaper. Now, if I remember rightly, the hidden life is on this level. So we go up here. There it is. But you then get DQ'd and put all the way back here. So. Quite often, you will end up losing the life that you've just earned. Also, these cars are super drifty, so you've got to be careful. Oh my god, it's like they have no tyres. Oops. Whee! Oh, oh no! <laughs> Fuck this noise. Oh, they put me back there. Thank you. Thank you. Oh! And down this tube of wallpaper again. The wallpaper straight. Oh, goodbye. I'm back up to third. The drift through is real. This is one of those games where, in theory, you don't ever have to break, but you have to be really good. Right. 
Oh, God. Oh, no. There we go. We're good. We're good. All right. I need to finish at least second to avoid wasting the life I just gained. At least on this level, if you fail, you can then just grab the life on the next run. So you never end up actually losing any lives. All right. There we go. Back up to second, though. Don't know where the leader is, but... No, we don't. Oh, my God. No. No. There we go. We're still in second. All right. Just get through this final jump. Oh, yeah. Yeah! DIY because it's unfinished. Yeah. Did that look finished to you? That DIY. And Tonk advances. Bury my body. Bit of a grim name for a level, but you'll see why it's called that in a minute. I use Twitter mostly for sports news and spreading my thoughts on sports. That's kind of what I do about Instagram, really. I'm just like, oh, hey, look, sports. Do the thing. I just post on my Instagram stories. I'm like, fuck it, women have actually won a thing. So basically, this is another beach level, and as you can probably tell, someone buried their dad in the sand. So, um, that kind of sinister and potentially tragic event there, which being passed off as comedy, because the 90s... Oh my god, smelly toes. That's not nice, that's distracting me there. Thank god this game didn't have smell of vision Oops. Oh, where did the track go? Alright, <clears throat> okay, focus. We're still in second, we're okay. Some cheesy sunglasses there, big fan of that. I quite like the fact that there were so many tracks in this game... Like, the track design was really interesting. You get some levels that were deceptively simple tracks, but... For example, I swear I remember there was one track, at least one track, where it was basically an oval, or like a, a rectangle layout. Kind of like Indianapolis or something. But the cars were so fast, you had to be... You had to have amazing reactions to get round it. So, it was a deceptively simple track. One was literally the lead of a toilet bowl. It was literally a toilet seat, and you were driving it in these super fast dragsters. Just going round in circles in a super fast dragster. Just non-stop driftu. So, there you go. A lot of hateful people and tro trolls on Twitter. Yeah. Yeah. Just even, even nice people, they sort of use it as a venting place. <laughs> okay. James, you work out that rage against the FAI? The Football Association of Ireland? Is it? I mean... Confess, confess the sins of the FAI here if you need to. Right, we're going to drive monster trucks around a music room. Right. Oh, everyone's... All of the AI are at full speed. Whee! I don't know what was used at the ramp there, but something. Some cassette tapes. There's some... Oh, God. Me nearly falling off. There's some tape cassettes. There's a keyboard. We're, we're actually driving around Nay's bedroom here. This is the studio where he makes all his ghost hall tracks. There you go, and he's actually sampled that for his new ghost hall record. Ow, including that. Whoa, God. Whoa. Avoid the tape decks. There we go. <laughs> I love the fact that it plays the sound of each car going over the keyboard. Even if you can't see the keyboard, if it's not on screen, and a car's going over it somewhere in the race, I like that. The sort of shit was kind of futuristic. It was like, this is back in the days where... Like, gaming was so basic that you just assumed that whatever wasn't on screen didn't exist. It just wasn't loaded or anything. But I like the fact that those sort of touches were like, yeah, this is a real-time race happening. And over there, meanwhile, on the other side of the circuit... Oh, look at this. There is one version of this track where I think you drive around a record player that's actually playing. And I think based on how fast or how slow you go, it plays... What's the bit of music that goes that one? I can't remember. Some sort of classical thing. Do do do. When I was a kid, I was like, it's not Escop Seven, so I don't recognise it. And then when I was a teenager, I was like, it's not Green Day, I don't recognise it. Well, we're leading anyway. This is a dominant performance. Well, I need to get back in the win column. I've been sneaking some seconds recently, so I've not really been showing championship form. Oh, boing boing boing. I like that touch, though. It didn't um, didn't play the notes because I was just bouncing along the black keys. Whee! Not the band. That would have been a bit weird. They don't like being bounced on. There we go. Fur release. There we go. That's the one. What the fuck is that engine sound? <laughs> Space sounds. <laughs> Drift here. All right. Chaunt wins. That's what we need to care about. Oh, here we go. You remember I was just talking about the dragsters? Guess what this is? It's dragsters racing around a bath. Oh, God. <laughs> I 
As a nice demonstration, two of the AI cars fell off at the first turn. Now, if I remember rightly... Oh, bollocks! I don't remember rightly. Where's the turn? Oh, it's here! It's those ducks that are the giveaway. There are barely any visual cues as for when the turn is, either. Bollocks! Fuck. This is not good. Right, okay, stick them on. There we go. Boing, boing. So, two towels, and then when you see the ducks, turn right. There you go! And then... <laughs> if I remember rightly, old bot, yeah. I don't remember rightly. Shallow line is the... Oh, it's worked! Nearly. Yeah. Come on, can we catch up? Can we save a qualifying spot? Where are the ducks? Ducks, the mighty ducks. And then... Okay. Oh, we're, we're going to go on to our first loss. <laughs> I love the fact he still makes the... Noise. Even though you're, like, plunging into water. I guess the sploosh noise was too much to add. All right, we've lost our first life, but we did have... Well, we had five, okay. Of course, because we gained the extra one from that other level, didn't we? There's some ifs. <laughs> you see the ducks turn right. Yeah, the pace notes for this race is just... Top speed, 100. Three right, past taps. Three right, past rubber ducks. Okay, here we go. <laughs> this just isn't going well, is it? Okay, focus. Focus, AJ. We've got to do this. Right. Three right at ducks. Oh, get out of the way, you peanut. Dude, Jesus. Oh, God. Oh, you... <laughs> Fuck's sake. Oh, no. Right, I'm not going to let this track be our nemesis. Come on. Come on, AJ. Tap into those old techers. It's out the way. <laughs> we'll just punterino the AI off the track. That's a good strat as well. Okay. All right, come on. Come on, where's the green car? Three right at ducks. Oh, come on. Come on. Yes. Send it. I've yeeted him on the final corner. Fuck yeah. <laughs> and we've ended up in a human centipede formation across the line. Yes, I'll take that. Bang. There we go. Referee Robert Dark has got to stop this contest at three seconds. <laughs> oh, that was lucky. I just caught my Mega Drive cable and I was like, please don't break the game. Oh, you know what I was talking about with like oval tracks? Here's one. Stupidly fast beach buggies. <laughs> but it's it's got sort of banking because it's a beach track. But you can go too fast and just fall straight over them. Oh, look at that though. Slide job. This is what Dale Earnhardt Jr. played as a kid. Slide job. Slide job. So many slide jobs. Right. Right. Three left at shovel. Oh, God. Oh, this is a battle. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Three left at Coke can. Whoa. Oh, oh, around the high side. Look at that. High siding it. Fuck yeah. Still haven't braked. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, yes. Yeah. Of course I won on the oval track. Of course I won on the bank NASCAR style track. It's more of an ellipse with the line you're taking. Very nice. Right, Delora. We defeat Delora in a straight battle. That's good. Ooh, this was an evil one, if I remember rightly. I think there were 25 races in challenge mode, so we're, go we're going quite well. Understandably, the final few were fucking evil, so we'll get ready for that. This is one of the first of the mildly evil ones. As you can guess from the theme, we're driving basically Land Rovers, and we're driving them around the roof of a house. Well, around the roof of a very shit treehouse. In fact, I think this is the track where the uh, thumbnail image came from. Going off very old memories of... <laughs> Fuck you. Oh, that's so satisfying. This that... Oh, God. All right, let's go in the guttering. There we go. And a turn there. If I remember rightly, there's quite an evil jump up here. Yes! Oh, come on. Told you there was an evil jump. You land and then immediately have to somehow swing right. So you, it's better to try and turn right as you launch. Oh, and those brown sort of spirals on the track, oops, um, if you run over them, they fall out. So you end up basically, those brown, you see that brown spirally thing there? There we go. Oh, come on. 
Oh, go on. Oh, the blue card's playing. No! <laughs> Bollocks. I was like, hi, I'm about to pass you for the lead. Although the yellow card did fuck up. Again, I like another thing I like about this game, the AI... <laughs> the AI fuck up, which is useful when you fuck up quite a lot. There we go. Made it. Second chance corner, that one. All right. Oh, God, they are so far in front. All right, come on. We need, to, we need a big comeback on the final lap. I've got some lives to spare, but I don't want to use them. This is kind of like Sonic Spinball. You can come into the final level thinking... <laughs> thinking you've got loads of lives in hand and then end up using all of them and they're still not enough. Because the final level of that fucking game is evil. Go on, we got that right. Come on, Red Land Rover. You got this. Turn a bit in the air. Come on. There you go. Nice. All oh, the top two are battling. You can see the helmets changing colour in the top left. Oh, there you go. Ran over it. Balls. Balls. I hate everything. Couldn't even crash. Loads of content for a Mega Drive game. It really is. There's a lot of content in this game. For a Mega Drive game, there's so much to do in it. I think I sunk so many hours into it. Right, we've lost our second life. No big deal. Still got three. And Chonk. <laughs> Streets of Rage is another game you can never have too many lives for the final level. Yeah. Right. Here we go. Get out the way. Get out the way. Right. Turn this way. There you go. Oh, God. There we go. It being top down was fucking evil as well. Because there were so many turns, as you've seen, where you're like, how are you supposed to know how to take them, given that you can be approaching them at fucking a scale speed of 800 miles an hour and will only see them half a second before you expect it to make the turn? It is mean, this game, but... In a sort of loving way. I guess you could say this was before Dark Souls. Us gen, us millennials had this. Oh. Well, this time we're dominating though. This is good. Oh. <clears throat> we're leading. I'm not going to say we're dominating. In fact, I just saw the yellow car flash onto the screen for a second. Let's get the fuck out of here. I told you this level was... Uh, well, this, uh, this game got evil. Maybe this is where it inspired the difficulty level for Dirt Rally 2.0. Or I could just be being incompetent. No! Mm! Pass for the lead. Right. Come back. And ow! <laughs> Alright, okay, come on, come on, stay calm. Stop. Oh, you fell off! Yes! Oh, no! Come back! Slide job! No! Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> oh, that was so close. Fuck, this is going to be a battle for the win. Who can fuck up the least on this final lap? Not me. There we go. Oh, my God. If we make one mistake here, that yellow car is going to pass us. Come on. Come on. Come on. <laughs> and... Yes! There we go. Lovely. British Pokemon 27 is here. Hello. Most evil level of my gaming life came in wet. Chapter... Fuck chapter 6. Kind of tempted to watch a speedrun of this later. Oh, that'd be interesting. Do you know what I was watching a speedrun of the other day? Randomly, was Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone on PS1. A game we've done a beatdown on. But, um... There's a guy called... Uh, I think his channel's called Zed vs. The World now. But he used to be called Shovel Warehouse. And he did a really nice, entertaining... Stream... Complete series of that game. Um... And he... I'm having to focus here. Oh, God. What is going on? Fuck you. Oh, it's this one. Balls. Fuck you. Oi. <laughs> Me and this yellow car are fucking getting into it. Uh, what was I saying? Oh, yeah. About uh, Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone on PS1. I actually ended up watching a speed run of it. And I just kept laughing because where he was having to go as fast as possible, uh, he just kept skipping through the cutscenes as quickly as possible. But it's one of those things where you just skip a line of dialogue at, at once. So I literally it was just like, Hello, he Mouth. Hedwig was through. A oh, bollocks. No. No. He's right there. Come on. Oh, we're going to have to yeet it spectacularly on the final corner. No. Bollocks. <laughs> Harry Potter PS1 should be bad. <laughs> but it was entertaining to watch the speed run of it. <clears throat> because it was also, it meant, you know, the game wasn't on my screen for as... For any longer than it needed to be. 
And I just thought the, the cutscenes were quite funny. So it was like, Hello, Harry. Draco Malfoy's through. Let's go. Fuck. Stuff. <laughs> it's like fuck in that game. You know. Don't remember anyone saying bollocks in the cutscenes. I do remember someone saying, Ooh. Ooh. You can tell the, you can tell we're really getting strong on the <laughs> What the fuck just happened there? You can tell we're getting stern on the difficulty level now because almost all the AI cars are actually faster than me in a straight line now. Bollocks. So there we go. Bollocks. <laughs> right, avoid the vices. Oh god. Avoid vice magazine. <laughs> right. Oh, there we go. We are close though. Right. There you go. Oh god. Come on. Come on, we can do this. Come on! Let's go for the win. Even though the blue car is faster than his top speed. Can we yeet the final corner? Yeet the final... Yes! Yeah! Fuck you. Bang in. That was awesome. We need to shortcut the final corner. Bounced off a drill bit. Blue car just punterino just across the line. That was so good. Was there just an issue with the street? Just randomly said, welcome to Armour Arcade's chat room. Tell you what, they're terrible now, but for the time, yeah, they looked awful, but the gameplay was decent. The Yeet Boop crossover. Yeah, I mean, the Force of Stone is not the worst game we've ever played. It's just kind of bollocks. It's just kind of the voice acting's bad, and it's just sort of very linear and a bit boring and weird. There's plenty of us to laugh at, in fairness. Right. Oh, this is the. Oh no, this is the one with the xylophone. 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 I'll identify this thing. And you have to avoid getting booped by that. You also have to avoid doing that. You have to avoid getting booped by that thing. Because it will basically knock you off straight away. Oh god, there's another one. Help! I never want to hear Twinkle Twinkle Little Fucking Star ever again in my life after this. It is Twinkle Twinkle Little Star it's playing, isn't it? Do, 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 do. Oh, fuck. I got boobs. I got boobs again. I got, oh, I've got boobs a third time. Fuck's sake. Oh, <laughs> got fucked over by fucking pleb playing the xylophone. I know I always hate the xylophone as an instrument. No. Ah, no. I'm getting, getting boobs. I got boobs again. This race has just become an absolute chode. Tell you what. Smashing Vettel that has, can never use the excuse of getting booped by a xylophone. Dump. Are you serious? Oh my god. This is number one bullshit. No, I'm not going to be lost. Fuck off. I'm not going to be lost. Fuck you. Oh my god, if the green car gets booped. Oh no, there we go. Bye. I hate this world. There's no booperino. <clears throat> Misfit World Cup. Oh man. Right, bollocks of that. Oh, we've only got one life left now. Jesus, we've been losing lives a lot quicker than I thought. Okay, come on. This is race 19 of 25. This is still very good, given I haven't played this game in fucking 20 years or whatever. Right, okay. Let's avoid Booperino. Please no Booperino. Let's jump out to an early lead. Always a good start. Whee! Come on. <gasps> there we go. We're good. Whee! I assume they're plectrums that they use as improvised ramps. Uh, just avoided it there. There we go. We're good. I'm just basically going fucking flat out because if I do get booped at some point, I'll have room to... Oh, hang on. Come on. Where it's going up and down the octaves of playing it, it sort of jumps up and down the, the booper. The thing. That's very high up the instrument. So that, uh, there we go. That was close. If it's right at the end of it, right at the top end, where the notes are so narrow. Uh oh. There we go. Come on. Come on. Can we avoid Pooperino for one more straight? Come on. Yep. There we go. There we go. Oh, yeah. Perfect run. This is number one bullshit. It's a weird minor version of Twinkle Twinkle Little Star. It, it is. Yeah, it's got that sort of sinister hor horror film vibe to it. Maybe it's trying to distract the player. I'll call it the Boople Knob. <laughs> oh, here we go. Right, remember earlier I used to say, said I used to screw over my dad when we played each other at this game. There's a variation of one of these levels because these are levels set in the kitchen. 
And there's one of them where part of the course involves going onto a, a sponge and using the sponge as a raft across the filled sink. Guess who used to deliberately hold back, wait until my dad had parked up on the ferry, on the sponge ferry, and just punt him straight off into the water. Over and over. He could not cope with my universe break. Where am I going? <laughs> oh, bollocks. No. Oh, my God. I, this level was evil because there were so many. Well, you've got to be careful of that. Oh, God. I hit the wrong pixel. Oh, God. Oh, where am I going now? I think it goes left in a minute. There we go. Over a chopped pepper. Yeah, so many of these obstacles were like weird. Oh, I didn't... Oops. What? What the fuck? What the f What in the name of fuck was that? That is a brutal track limit penalty. That is number one bullshit right there. Not even that. That is nonsense. Yeah, I, I didn't say this game was fair. I still maintain it's a really good game, but it's... It has a difficulty level of its time, shall we say, which is fucking absurd. Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah, one reason this level is evil is because there's so many obstacles that will just stop you dead. There we go. Don't make me want toast. I eat enough toast. Right, and then we go left in a minute. There we go. And then we go left in a minute. We don't go right. I thought we did. Right. There we go. For some reason, that wasn't corner cutting that time. Fuck. <laughs> is this where we lose our last life? No, it isn't, because the green car is slow as shit, and we've caught them up. Yes! In fact, there's the leader. Fuck yeah, we can make a run for the victory here. Let's go for it. Let's come back from our number one bullshit track limit penalty. Fuck out my way. Oh, he recovered. Oh, no, he didn't. <laughs> he hit the world's heaviest stock cube. Bollocks. There's a oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. was so close. Oh, no. See what I mean about those? I think they're stock cubes or something at the side of the track. Those mushrooms are the same. Oh, someone just fell off. God damn, this has been a dramatic race. Don't. There we go. I was going to say, don't fucking track limits me, you bitch. All right. Come Are we going to come back for the win? Is this going to be an amazing comeback victory? Oh, hell yeah, it is. I'm just sitting there in my car, just like, as everyone else comes across the line, just flipping them off out the window. Sugar cubes. There they are. Is that a toaster flush with the countertop? Yeah. Pretty swanky kitchen. Kota. <laughs> Ball chase. You remember I told you about the other snooker pool table level? We did it, Reddit. <laughs> Alright, here we go. This is it. Cam, this one's for you. This is the direction the ACO should go with LMP1. Oh my god. That's not the direction I should go at all. Oh, I'm gone. <laughs> Bollocks. That's the turn. <laughs> I'm being punished for my hubris. Bollocks. Where's the track go? Oh, there we go. That's the bit. If you get fucked up there, that cube... There you see, that cue ball's flying up behind us there. That's something that no Le Mans driver has ever had to say. <laughs> Fucking Ponterino. Oh, God. There we go. I love the fact that apparently there's just a guy just walking up and down the table with potting, uh, just hitting a white cue ball up and down the table. Whee! Alright. Oh, bollocks. Oh, I think the uh, blue car just got smacked by uh, the cue. Cue ball, something. Come on. This is, these were probably my favourite levels in, the, in this game. Le Mans sports cars and snook tables, two of my favourite things. Like I say, I had that sort of Smaller size. It was like a half size, maybe quarter size snooker table. Um, and in the end, I just used it for racetracks. I, I built tracks like this on it. Just used like the cue balls and the, and the, well, the balls in general and the cue to mark out a track. And in the end, I just ended up ripping up the cloth on it and just making it a permanent racetrack. So, uh, am I a snooker or a pool guy? Probably more snook snooker to watch, pool to play. That's the best way to put it. Borat would have been proud of his men beating three, uh, Scott, Scotland 3 0. No, I remember that. Avoid the giant cue ball down the mall side. <laughs> remember to charge your ERS to keep ahead of the cue ball. <laughs> yeah. Oh, this one's evil. So, this is another one of those driving around a playset meta levels. But as the name suggests. 
And so if I remember rightly, the cars are really freaking fast. And then those cars there. Cars come across the road at you. Oh god. Oh god. This is very complicated as well. Oh my god. This is basically like the Nordschleife toy box edition. Bollocks. There we go. Oh, get out of the way. Whoa. Oh. <laughs> yes! Oh no! Oh no, I immediately fucked up. Damn it. That was so close to being awesome. I completely screwed over the yellow car and got him knobbed over by the uh, traffic on that crossing. And then immediately fucked it and fell off. GG, AJ. Well done. Uh, we're still in second, though. Bollocks. We're still, still in second. Someone just, someone just put up... Fuck a swear jar. Don't literally fuck a swear jar. you probably get your penis caught in it. Oh, bollocks. No, 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 no. No. All right. Keep calm. Keep calm. Oh, God. That was close. All right. Keep calm. Keep calm and carry on. Second's still good enough. Obviously, I think in the final round, you have to win. There's no choice. And it is the most evil final level. Is that... The green car's being lapped. Oh, what a peanut. Right, maybe he's helped hold up the... Oh, my God. That was close. Oh, go on. Make a run for it. Go on. Oh, so close. Yeah. Oh, you got lapped, son. You got lapped. I mean, that's just disgusting. Yeah. Right. Is that race 21? Wow, race 23. Holy fuck. AJ, this one's evil. AJ wins. I played a lot of this game when I was a kid. Question for the Chateau. Which games did you have when you were younger and you played so much that you're still pretty good at them now? She's in the 2015 manor. <laughs> I remember this one's interesting. Because, the, yeah, that... <laughs> I love the fact that on a 2D, uh, 2D graphics, they tried to showcase elevation changes. Oh, fuck. Oh, and these cars are so drifty as well. So this one, look. And now this one's going down. There you go. Such good track design in this game. Such creative track design, which I don't think they've ever quite got back. Bollocks. <laughs> That's what I was trying to say in the last race. Sort of swear jar. I don't need a swear jar. I just need a bollocks jar. Whoa, God. There we go. Oh my god, the Drifter is real. It's like these cars have no tires. Oh my god, it's going downhill. If I remember rightly. Yeah. I remembered rightly. It doesn't mean I could avoid it. Bollocks. <laughs> right. A jar full of bollocks. Yeah, that's me. Out the way. Right, I'm on the comeback trail. Going uphill now. Uphill. I love the fact this is like seemingly outdoors. Someone's just doing wallpapering outside. That's why I always interpreted it as as a kid. Although, that's not really grass texture, is it? That's just a, like, a floor pattern. We're doing the wallpaper in the biggest bathroom ever. We might actually have to let off the accelerator on some of these runs here. Unbelievably. All right, we're back up to second, though. No need to panic. Just yet. There we go. <laughs> like, where's the corner? It's up here somewhere. Brake still didn't work. <laughs> Fuck this game. I love this game, but Jesus, it's mean. Why would you do that? Actually, they're code masters. We know from Dirt Rally that, well, we know from the Dirt games that they're, they're like, oh, we'll just put this massive flat out section and a ramp and a hill and a jump right in front of a tight hairpin. So you're still in midair as the hairpin sails underneath you. Because we're just really mean like that. You like us, but we're also. That was just my fuck up, in fairness. <laughs> oh, God. There's the yellow car. Come on. Bollocks. No. 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 Oh, we're so much faster than the yellow car, though. Right, come on. Come on. Okay, this is pressure, because we can't fuck up the bottom of this ramp, can we? There we go. <laughs> just beetled around the... I'm just beetling around the final few corners. Oh, he's trying to send it, but he won't. He won't succeed. Yeah, there you go. Ever get to the end where you have to retire and get a monkey butler? <laughs> I played The Sims a lot and still play it to the series now. Yes! Both Vigilante 8 games on the N64. I know all the secret areas. Mario Kart 64. Arenas of Destruction. Tetris, in it. We are also sneaky in Force Always Online and Day 1 DLC down your throat. Yeah, that was a downside to Dirt Rally 2.0. I might need to have a word with them. Oh, no. God, I hate this level. 
So you know how the last one introduced elevation changes? This one introduces moving your helicopter up and down to clear obstacles. What was the button? Oh my god, I can't remember what button it was. Oh my god, it was down to go up. And up to... Up to go down. There you go. Right. Can we just go... Can we just go the whole... Of course you can't. Oh my god, these helicopter levels were fucking evil. Right, I'm just going to stay up most of the time. No. Oh, I've lost this race. What am I talking about? Through there. Through there. This game... Game doesn't need... Nobody wanted micro helicopters game. I'm going to get... Oh my god, I'm going to get lapped at this rate. Right. Through here. And then down. And then up again. Oh my god, I'm so far behind. There's no music or anything. And because these car these helicopters are so quiet. Oh, now I'm getting my techers on. No, I'm not. I'll just get this over with. I'm so lost. I'm just sort of hovering above the level. At least... At least... We didn't fall off the... Well, you can't fall off the edge in a helicopter. Is that how it ends? We get one more chance, do we? Or is that it? We have no more lives. No, that's it. I'm actually quite impressed I made it to t race 24 out of 25 with Antonk there. I'm pretty impressed with that, given I haven't played this game in years. And how evil the game is. So, trust me, there are 25 races in that challenge mode. We made it to 24. I'll take it. So, now what we're going to do is move on to... Head-to-head -head is the same tracks as Challenge. But with uh, just one AI opponent. So, sod that. We're going to go to Super League, which was actually my favourite mode in this game. Because as the name suggests... Alright, where's, uh, where's our Chonky boy? There he is. Chonk! Saves your name as well. I like that. So, here we go. There's three races per league. And you get moved up if you win the group and then relegated down. So, they just kept going. There's no lives in this one. And I like the sort of championship element as well. That was really interesting. So, we're in the first round of Division 4. Let's do this! Yeah, this is easily my favourite mode. Division 1, as you can understand, fucking evil. But we've got to get there first, so... Get out of the way! You donut. And if I'm, oh, God! Oh, there's those uh, holes in the floor that can emerge. What would you call them? Just rotting wood? Whoever's treehouse is their dad used shit wood for it. Shit wood, no fans. Oh, you've got to stay on it for a consistent amount of time. Okay. You've got to be careful because you don't know if someone else has run it over and knocked the hole out. So you'll come around and you're like, that was solid before. Or if it's just me, you'll just fuck up on your own. There you go. And an easy win. Start Division 4. They're called Knots. There you go. Knots in the wood. Knots County. Oh, a strong win in the first round. I think the point system is really simple. Yeah, 4 3 2 1. <laughs> easy. Right, so we lead Division 1 after the first round. Round 2 is gone. Jumps to another ATV off-road fury race around the garden. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Oops. Some fucking happening behind us. Literally two ATVs. When two ATVs love each other very much. Bollocks. Bollocks counter for each race. One. There we go. Come on, send it. There we go. Hi. Hi, mate. How you doing? <laughs> Never not funny. Never not funny. Whee! All right, we're in the lead. We should go for the sweep here. Was it three races per division or four? I think it was four, actually. And think about, you know, we were just talking about the amount of content in the game. We've had 20, well, there were 25 unique tracks in the uh, challenge mode. And as far as I remember, a lot of the tracks in this mode are unique to this mode as well. And then in time trial and multiplayer, there's 25 odd tracks that a lot of, there's a lot of tracks that are unique to each mode, as well as some tracks that you can run in uh, single player, multiplayer and challenge or super league mode. So that's a fuck ton of content for a Mega Drive game. There's a reason why I rinsed hours into this game. There is so much to play. We've gone through an hour already, and we could probably fill the rest of the two the two hours left um, with fucking Super League. The fucking Super League, yeah. 
again, uh, go on Pornhub to check that one out. Oh, God. All right, we're in the lead by miles. Division 4 is pretty easy, to be honest, as it should be. So I, I like fucking around in the Division 4. Just fucking with the AI. Or going for Grand Slams, just winning all the races. Jack is back in British Touring Cars. Yes, he is. I, I'm not a huge Jack off. <laughs> See you later, James Carmody. We'll be in and out streams for the next three months. We'll try and catch them where I can. No problem, man. Remember, the VODs will be up for you to watch as well if you can't watch them live. Right, so two races in. Yeah, I think it was four races per division. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, so you remember earlier I said about that track that was literally racing around a toilet seat? This is it. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, no. Bristol could never. It's just constant drift do. Constant drift do. Oh, we're about to lap up. No. Oh, God. That was so close. Fuck this noise! <laughs> oh, I love doing that. So we lapped half the field in a three-lap race. Ran the 0.2 mile uh, toilet seat speedway. <laughs> Impressed. That's normally the one I fuck up in this first division. Almost every time. Yeah, there are four rounds. Chainsaw chase. Okay. Wonder what sort of obstacle we're going to find in this one. And also, as we're in divisions, we can actually remember what the names of the other drivers are. So Suli. Suli? Spider in the yellow car and Davey in the green car. Oh, shit. <laughs> Lancia 037. Yes, these are meaning Lancias. Oh my god, how does this track go? Can't remember it. Oh, yeah, okay. So just don't get mangled by the ch running chainsaws that people have left on. Whoever's uh, workshop this is, they're not very health and safety conscious, are they? What have they left running so far in various races? Running chainsaws, drills, uh, vices. Oh, God. Um, wouldn't surprise me if there's a level somewhere in this game. I can't remember if there is or not. But um, I'm surprised they didn't have a level in this game where there was just like a blowtorch just left running. Avoid the jets of flame. We are rinsing this race. The Grand Slam is on for Division 4. We're going to smash this one, lads. We like that in, in sport, well, especially in English sports, where they have like a league promotion relegation structure more often. But someone suddenly builds a team... It's just like, I'm going to start a new team. Well, they're going to have to start at the bottom of the division. That's all right. I'll just buy everyone and basically have a Premier League or a top tier team in the fourth tier or something. Why haven't they caught on fire yet? Right, so there we go. We Grand Slam the first round, first division. Move up to the third division. It's over on the left. Yeah, of course I do. <laughs> Can you imagine that if you're a football club? Do you want to get... You've just been promoted. Do you want to keep playing? No. We're going to retire undefeated. After getting out of the Estimian League South. Right, we're now in a division with Maria, Violet, Adina and Chonk. And Chonk. Oh, it's another cam special. Q Capers. In our LMP1 cars. Maria's in the blue. Green's in the... Adina's in the green. And Violet... I want to be Billy Idol is in the yellow car. I would have immediately forgotten of those right about now. Where we go. Oh, this is a pretty, uh, this must be a, a snooker table in a pretty rough, rough bar because there's, there's some tears in the table. I also love the mechanic where you can drive into random, oh my god, we're going up here now, aren't we? Yeah. Oh, if I remember rightly, one of the AI cars line puts them right on the edge. It's almost like the, oh god, that was close. Oh, bollocks. That happens as well. Why is there someone queuing on the table itself? That makes no sense. Game, what is your logic for... Ow. Ow. Okay. I'm not going to win this one, I don't think. Oh, we can still come back, though. We're not that far behind. I just know where I'm going. Right. Four left. Uh, four right at yellow ball. Three left at Q-tip sharpener. Oh, pubes. Pubes. Hang on. There we go. Yeah. Someone just messaged me. Yes. Okay, hang on. I'll check that in a minute. I'm busy racing a LMP1 car around. Oh, fuck. Lewis, stop messaging me. My phone, is, my phone is distracting me. Can we get some whys in chat for my friend messaging me and distracting me and causing me to crash? 
Never mind, I'll just fuck up the track limits all over the place. They're more sort of vague suggestions. There we go. Right, I think we're miles behind the leader now, but fuck it. We'll still finish second, get a good haul of points. We're going to points race this one. Bollocks! <laughs> that corner has been my nemesis so far in this race. Right, where is the left turn? It is here. Avoid the queues. <gasps> Including the queue that's on the playing surface itself. That doesn't make any friggin' sense. Let's just ignore the track limits. I mean, the leader's already won. Bye. There we go. The car in the intro of the race looked like the old Jaguar GTP car. I suppose so. Well, it, was, it was the XJR5 GTP. They're just known as sports cars. Right, so Maria takes the first win. I also like the fact there was infinite amount. If you couldn't get promoted out of one... Oh, no. Oh, God, I hated this one. This was the most boring race. Yeah, it's speedboats. You're going down. And the water's always pushing you down. So look, I don't have to accelerate. <laughs> I really don't have to accelerate. But there's all these obstacles that are just solid. Those water splash things are sort of uh, speed boosty things. And this level's just horrible. This level's just Ebola. It's just so boring because you're just constantly bouncing off things and speedboats don't make any noise, so you're just trundling along in silence. Basically, for the most part, when this game's involving we vehicles with wheels, it's really good. When it doesn't involve vehicles with wheels, it's normally absolute tetanus. Um, <laughs> there is one exception to that, and we'll get to that at some point, hopefully. But helicopters have been tedium. Boaty McBoat faces have been tedium. Let's do the speed. Well, it's not even a speed. <laughs> also, note the fact that this track layout doesn't make any sense. It keeps going in one direction. There's no... You don't go around in a circle. This just keeps infinitely looping. It's like this... This lake, whatever it is, is mirrored three times over. Oh, bollocks! <laughs> I was hoping to do the brake trick, on the brake check trick on... Try and say that three times. Fast. Get out of the way! Even the contact physics on this level aren't as fun. Oh, bollocks, where am I going? Oh, pubes, I just want to finish. Please finish this right. Thank you. There we go. It, it sounds like those electric shopping scooter trolley things. <laughs> Amazing. Right, well, we won anyway, so I'll take it. And Maria, who won the first race, was only third. Which is quite useful. So we're now in the lead by a point. Ah! You remember earlier I was talking about the music theme level? Where there was... Uh, we uh, went on a, a vinyl... Vi a record deck. Kind of a giveaway in the title, but yeah, this is the one. Where we go! Still remember the layout of some of these tracks. That, that's the version of, what was it? Furry, furry Elise. Furry Lotus Elise. My furry is a Lotus Elise sports car. That would make me be a furry. If you could be a car, but then why would you be? Wouldn't that be a metally? I like the fact that it played as long as... Bollocks! As long as you were on that record deck, it would play. The, the, the vinyl is clearly turning, though. So why it's not playing when you're not on it, I don't know. Do the cars have little needles in the bottom of them? They're suddenly playing the records. Although that would just be like... Vroom, vroom, vroom. Bollocks! And for some reason, it randomly glitched and just kept playing. All right, never mind. Well, this championship's going down to the wire, isn't it? <laughs> well, if I can finish second. Which is not a guarantee. There we go. Yeah! Right, well, this is going down to the wire. <laughs> Violet there, just being like, doing like dual John Cena hands there. I can't see myself. All right, Antonk finished second. Well, we're tied on 10 points going into the final round of Division 3. 
And it's called Step On It. I can't remember what this track goes. It's the one I think it is. It's kind of terrifying. Oh, no, it is. So you remember I talked about those tracks where they're like ovals, but the AI, the cars are really, really fast. No, it's not that. Okay, it's not that one. There is a version of this type of uh, track where... Uh, oh, it's really not that. Okay, good. Bollocks. This is a weird step ladder that you have to basically go... <laughs> okay, AJ, can you stop crashing? It's not a way to win a championship. Oop. Get out of the water. Why did you adjust your line in a straight line, you peanut? Not that I'm complaining, because I've got, I've got back in second, but where the fuck's Maria? There we go. There's a lot of momentum-based obstacles on this track. If you hit a wall or lose speed, you won't have the momentum to get over the obstacle. <laughs> Alright, stay calm. Stay focused. Alright, she's not that far ahead. This is basically winner takes all, though. Bollocks! Yeah, you know what I said earlier about the momentum thing? That's what happens. Oh, dear. Anyway, right, well, we've lost this championship. But like I said earlier, because there's no lives in this mode, you can... If you don't get promoted out of a division, you can keep playing this mode basically forever. If you wanted to. It would probably get boring after a while. But, um... Oh, oh my God! She's right there! Uh, no! No! <laughs> no! <laughs> oh! Oh! So, we briefly had a chance at the greatest comeback in history, and I was so shocked, I'm like, just fell off immediately. Right, well, Maria's going to win the division. That's fine. She wins the third division, gets promoted. Violet gets uh, demoted. Violet, the uh, Billy Idol lookalike. So, well, Maria's moving up. Moving on up. F, yeah, F's in Chaplers. But uh, we just stay on in uh, Division 3, so we'll keep going. And Dwayne has been relegated down from Division 2. And, uh, well, this time we're going to have to win. I'm just going to have to win all the races. It, it's it's that simple. Right, so Dwayne's in the blue car this time. Let's go! <laughs> so much Ponterino. I love it. Oh my god, look at this. It's an intense battle pack coming around the first lap. Now, if I remember rightly, I couldn't show this the first time around. Yes, that's it. Oh my god. Oh! They take a line that's so close to the edge, it's really easy to punt them off. If you, It's deceptively hard to punt them off. Because you can easily just... Bollocks. Just fuck yourself over. Kind of like that, to be honest. But it is doable. So hopefully we'll be able to do that at some point in this race. All right, the green car ain't shit. Where's blue car? Where is uh, Dwayne? Dwayne the Block Johnson. Turn. I always fuck up this time. I haven't, though. Oh, he's up there. He's up there. He's going to be out of range for Ponterino this time. Oh. That was close. We are gaining, though. Come on. It's those freaking playing cards. What are they doing on a pool table? Oh, we're in the lead. I don't want to be. If you want to be my leader, you're going to have to not suck ass. Bollocks. Where am I going? All right, let's try and set it up for the epic Ponterino. On the final lap. Come on. Come on. No. Be in the lead. Stop being shit, Dwayne. Oh, God. Oh, fuck. Have I bollocks it up? Sort of. Yes! Oh, no! <laughs> no! <laughs> Fuck's sake. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, I've just totally fucked it up. But I'm still in the lead. Somehow. There we go. I've lost my hat. <laughs> my hat's fallen off. Everything's going wrong. Oh, no. But we are still going to win, unbelievably, just by fucking up the big take now. Oh, man. Oh, God, that was funny. Preston's here. Yeah. Oh, Dwayne was third in the end. Oh, that's amazing. We fucked him over so badly, he got knocked down to third. All right, so Antonk out in the lead. Oh, God, it's the most boring race ever. That's just... I'm just gonna... Fuck it, I'm going to take the L in this one. I can't be bothered. 
you. Yeah, there we go. So, how was your day? This is a, this is a race so boring. I refuse to do it. I am on strike. So I'm just gonna. Do, do, do. Brexit news. I don't need that. All the stations, nice. Yeah. Do 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 do, do, do. People I don't care about. Do do do. Is there anything happening in the no? Do 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 do. do. Preston, if this is your first uh, impression of the game, mm, stick with it. We've been doing a lot better. Most of this game is amazing. It's just this race is the most boring one in the history. Oh, we're being lapped. Being lapped. I literally couldn't give a toss. Do I'm tr trying to give a toss. No, still can't. Oh. He's basically completing the race by himself. Oh, here we go. This is the bit that you need to do. Hang on. So I'm actually having to drive this bit. And then if we go about here. And we don't have to drive it anymore. Do, do, do. And because the race auto finishes when everyone else does, you don't have to complete the race. Which is lovely. Wish Mario Kart Double Dash was like that, to be honest. I've got a perfect song for this. What's that? Hold music. I've been lapped again. Oh, the leader's already finished. Why have you not finished? Oh, can we just fuck around? We can fuck around with the leader. Come on, where's the... There he is! Oh! <laughs> we missed the chance. They've not even got horns. That's how boring the speedboats are. You started watching British basketball at the weekend. Oh, that's awesome! Yes! That's so cool. Have you found a team support yet? I've adopted teams in both the women, uh, the men's and women's British basketball leagues, which is quite cool. There's one, the local, the men's team I've adopted, London City Royals, play like half a, half an hour away from me in Crystal Palace. Of course, I had to represent the South London team. So this time, oops. Whoa! Oh, fuck you! No, you peanut! Oh god! I basically need to win the remaining races, given I just took the L in the last race. Alright, come on, come on. Let's get back to it. I'll oh, round the outside. But, um, yeah, if you found a team yet, that'd be awesome. I've adopted the Seven Oak Suns in the Women's uh, Basketball League, which is fucking awesome. I can't believe there's a team, sports team in Seven Oaks. And they're a badass women's basketball team, which is awesome. And then, yeah, London City Royals in the men's teams. I really want to go to games for both of them. It's such a shame. Basketball is a weird one in this country. Like, it's one of the most popular sports amongst being played by kids. We're going to finish. That's my thoughts on that race. <laughs> but yeah, um, British basketball. Uh, basketball is like the third most popular sport among kids in this country. But then, because... Old school, old school ties brigade. No colleges or sick forms or grammar schools really play it. It's rugby and some football if you're lucky. And in the summer we play cricket and that is it. There is no other summer sport. So yeah, it's kind of annoying. So that's why our basketball team is always like struggling for funding. Oh my god! <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that was amazing. Oh my god, someone clip that, please. Somebody please clip that, or I'll do that tomorrow or something. Oh man. The cluster fuck the, the cluster fruitcake that took everyone out. Alright, so we're in the lead. And at the moment, Dwayne is third. Oh my god. Are we gonna have to try and fix this race to try and win the championship? I think we're gonna have to. The battle for second is gonna be the interesting one. We have to somehow win this race, but make sure Dwayne doesn't finish second. Oh, bollocks, he's back up to second. Right, here we go. Come on, come on. Come on, where are they? Here we go. Right, fuck you, Dwayne. Fuck you, Dwayne. This is another great thing about this game. Oh, no, 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 no! <laughs> I got punished my hubris. 
No, not you. Get out of the way. I need you to be in front of Dwayne. Oh, that was close. That was so close. Oh, actual poo. There we go. We're good. All right, we need to find and destroy. We need to seek and destroy Dwayne. Bollocks. <laughs> oh, no, he's crashed. No, they both crashed. All right. Yes, come on, come on, come on. Come on, we need to fuck over Dwayne. Fuck over Dwayne, come on, fuck over. Oh, no! Yes! Come on! Right, where's the Yes! Yes, the second! Go! Finish! Finish! Yes! Yes! My strat worked! My genius strat worked! Guess you can't copy paste YouTube links in chat. Well, maybe we have to disable it. I think someone was trying to post some. Finding the men's Sheffield Sharks and the Leicester Riders. Nice. Is that the women's uh, Leicester Riders team? Yes! Our strat worked! Yes! Fuck you, Dwayne. <laughs> Moving on. No, no. Well, no, Adina's getting relegated because he was shit. And we are moving on up. Tonk is moving on up. There we go. Lovely. Right. Let's race again. Do the thing. Did anyone see someone just enter my room? I wonder. Anyway. Both of them. Oh, that's awesome. All right, this is another uh, loft-based track. Oh, we're up against Jeremy. Look at him there, the Tory. Jeremy the Tory. And he's in the blue car appropriately, because of course he is. Right. We're just going to fuck up Jeremy in this one. Fuck this one. Also, the irony of Jeremy being in a blue car and looking like a massive Tory... Oh, we, we are massively screwing him. Oh, goodbye. Oh, no! My anti-Tory bile came at a cost there. I don't remember where this track goes at all. That probably should be my primary concern right now. I should focus on my own party rather than, you know, fucking the Tories. Actually, everyone should be focused on fucking the Tories. Not literally. There you go. And then... If I remember rightly, this track's just a, an oval, or a square, I should say. <laughs> it's not going well. Black and Mild is here! Yes! Black and Mild is here just as I'm completely shitting the bed in this race. No, fuck this. Going the wrong way. I'm wrong weighing the shit. Fuck it. Oh my god! It's maybe the worst race I've ever had in this game ever. Fuck you. You're not finishing. Car Wars. Welcome to the reboot of Robot Wars. No. 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 Stop this guy finishing. Come on. Oh. <laughs> Sheer aggression here. No. Bollocks. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, Black and Mild is here, just as I completely shit the bed. So Black and Mild, just to explain, by the way, we're in the Super League section of Micro Machines 2, which is where there's four divisions, and each division has four races, and you get points, and the bottom one gets relegated, the top one gets promoted. So at the moment, after the shittiest first race ever, since, you know, smashed the Vettel last weekend, um, was it last weekend? No, it wasn't, but anyway, um, we need, we're on the comeback trail, so we're in some construction trucks again. Construction trucks, dump trucks, whatever. And oh, it's another corn on the cob based one. Which is now making me want sweet corn for dinner. Unfortunately, I don't think I have it. I think I have bolognese, though. Which is as good, to be honest. I'm easily running away with this race. Yes, this is the sort of game where you can nearly fuck up, save it, and then still fuck up. It's like jump scares in horror films where it's like, nah, nah. oh, wait, there's nothing there. And turn around. Now there is. Boing. Oh, the mysterious jelly physics of doom. <laughs> oh, fuck the Tories. Amazing. I wonder if we could do that IRL. Just shove. <laughs> just punt Tory cards into like a river or something. It's like Jacob Rees-Mogg is going along and he's like being chauffeured along in, in his like Maybach or something. 
and then someone just T-bones him straight into a lake. Like, I'm not saying murder him. That's, that's just evil. That's just bad. But, you know, sort of, it, like, ruin his suit. Ruin his nice suit. Inconvenience his day. Cover him in some sort of slurry. That's sort of what a Tory deserves. Do, 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 do. Can you tell I'm quite left-wing politically? <laughs> no, but seriously. Tories are shit. And we're beating one at the moment. Or if this was an American-themed game, it would be a Republic. No! Because Americans do it weird, don't you? you like, aren't, isn't it completely the other way around? Like, the Red Party is basically the Tories. And the Blue Party is kind of Labour, not Tories, whatever the alternative is. And it's normally a bit shit. But at least we're not those guys. Party. <laughs> Which is what the Lib Dems have kind of become over here. It's like, well, at least we're not those guys. Yeah, but what are you? Um, we haven't got to that bit yet. You're the people that bent over for the Tories a few years ago and immediately went back on a campaign promise, so now every one of my generation hates you. That was... was the, I don't know how we've entered like, political banter on the stream. Let's check the view count. Unbelievably, it's not gone down. None of you have left. But yeah, I remember that was the first general... Back in 2010, that was the first general election I voted in. And a load of us put our faith in the Lib Dems because they were like, we're going to make tuition fees a thing of the past. And then that's basically what happened. Like, three months in, the Tories were like, we need a coalition. Lib Dems were like, all right, we'll buddy up with you. And then the Tories were like, great, we're going to make it even more expensive than ever to go to university. And the Lib Dems were like, well, if I just look the other way. And then millions of people protested it and they were like, nope, don't know what you're talking about there. Order. <laughs> Right, well, we've beaten the Tory that time. Which is all that really matters in life. And we're still behind him in the championship, though. That is unacceptable. So let's inflict some picnic problems on him. There we go. Oh, this is a, not really an evil track. Just a sort of annoying one. Oh, my God, because that picnic, the picnic table pattern really fucks with my eyes for some reason. Okay, that's better. I can see where I'm going now. Okay. Some little sneaky bus stop chicanes around water. One left, don't cut. One right, don't cut. One left, don't cut. One right, don't cut. Because you'll do that. Oh, this, this one always made me crave penguin bus. Anyone remember those? Put in the chat what your favourite snacks were as a kid. So I always liked Derrily Dunkers, even though for some reason they always made me hyperactive, so my mum never liked getting me one. So every so often, if I was like, particularly good, she was like, you can have the thing that makes you a hyper little shit. Oh god, no. Nowadays, my favourite snacks are like chocolate digestives. The greatest biscuit the world has ever seen. Alongside custard creams, of course. You, you, you can tell how easily we're winning this race. I'm just having, like, biscuit banter. I've not yet seen an F1 Grand Prix so boring that David Cross has been like, So, Martin, what's your favourite kind of biscuit? Well, you know, I, I really prefer sort of bourbons with a nice sort of cup of coffee. That's quite nice. I remember there used to be a website. It's such a shame it doesn't run anymore. I don't think it exists anymore. Called anicecupoftea.com. And it was literally a site that reviewed brands of tea, uh, nice biscuits to have with your tea, Various tea-based sort of adventures, mugs, uh, armchairs to enjoy your tea in. I always wanted to do a podcast just called The Armchair Squad, which would involve talking about things you do in your armchair. Brackets, although you wouldn't actually write this except masturbating. Um, so, that was I mentioned it to someone, it was like, things you do in an armchair, and the guy was like, what about the thing? I'm like, oh, I hadn't thought of that. It was all about biscuits as a kid. I am so, so sorry, song from a few years ago. Maybe. Right, we now... I oh, was still not ahead of the Tory. Right, we're not having this. Oh, plate hop. This is an evil one. Okay. It all comes down to this. But, oh, what the bollock. What the bollock. Boing, boing, boing. Right turn here. Oh, chode! Absolute chungus. Oh, one of the 
Hob, hob, the. I don't want to talk about. Oh god. Yeah, those mushrooms will just ping you off in all sorts of directions. Oh, go on. Still somehow managed to catch up with the pack, but not the Tory. <laughs> Punterino, the yellow car, all over the place. Right, we've got to catch the Tory. Where is he? Not by doing that. It's not generally the. <gasps> That's not the strat either. We didn't fall off though. Bollocks, bollocks, bollocks. Yeah, where it's a mix of solid mushrooms and carrot and cucumber slice that ping you off all over the place. This one's. Oh god, particularly evil. You don't know if you're going to get pinged off backwards or. P that. Do, do, do. Boing, 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 boing. Right, come on, we can get this right. There we go. Don't hit the Oxo Cube thing, whatever it was. Nope, nope, nope. There we go. Nope, nope, no, nope, nope. Oh, wow, the Tory's already won. I hate this. <laughs> That's how much I hate. Armchair Squad. Yes. Armchair Squad. Oh, we still finished second. I don't know how that happened. Then how non existent Doritos Dragon's Fire wasabi flavour. I used to get them all the time as a kid. I vaguely remember those, I think. Right, well, unfortunately, the Tory gets promoted, but that means we don't have to deal with him in the next division. Maybe we got distracted. We got too emotional. We'll beat him in Division 1 instead. Right, Suli's coming up. Did she start out in Division 4 with us? She's moving on up. Right, we're into our, what, fourth season? Fourth or fifth season? Fifth. Fifth season. Right, so Lisa's now in the um, blue car. The white suburban mom. The white suburban cougar. <laughs> oh, that's... I, this game was so fun to fuck around with the AI in. Like that. Oh, can we get this guy, the green car, a second? Oh, my God. That was completely deserved, in fairness. Completely deserved. And then... There you go. Both us and the blue car are looking to come back. Chonk and Lisa are on the comeback tra trail. There we go. There we go. Take a nice wide line into the next corner. Oh, the green car's so shit. We tried to get you a race win, but it's just not going to happen. It's like trying to get a win for mana. No! Lisa! <laughs> hate this track so much. There's the turn. Right, we're not finishing last. Right, we're not finishing last. We're not finishing last. We're not finishing... There we go. Yeah! <laughs> Yeet! Fuck the noise! Moving on. The moving on. I'm glad someone got that reference. Right. Well, we did marginally better than the first race of the last season. We weren't last. That's all I can say about it, really. Get out of the way. Stop blithering. Right. This time, let's see if we can fuck over. Yes! <laughs> there we go. Alright, let's trundle along in third here. And run protection on these cars. Now, the, the plan is, and it probably won't work, but the plan's going to be... Actually, no, the green car's so slow. Get out of the way. Alright, we'll see if we can get the yellow car a win. And then, like the last round of Division 3... I completely fucked over the blue car and got the yellow car up to second. That will be the plan. No, no, no. You don't. You don't want to win this race. You just don't. No, you don't. Dumb bollocks! My hubris is punishing me. I'm being punished. My hubris. My lack of talent. Boing. That jelly is a is a absolute thunder bastard. Um. Because literally, it can just, like, if you hit it the wrong way, the physics are really weird. So, it can just ping you off. White yellow truck, how are you, what are you doing? Oh, my God. We're not even at the end of the first lap. Die. <laughs> oh, close. But we did still get the yellow truck back up second. There are some levels where certain AI cars just have, the, the speed differentials are too big. So, there's absolutely no way. Now, 
no, no matter how much AI fucking you do. Oh, blue blue truck survived. Blue truck to do do do, blue truck to do do do, baby, <sighs> baby truck to do do do. Right, <laughs> uh, continue to screw over the blue truck because we're really petty like that. Continues. I think sometimes I would even fuck around to make sure that another car got promoted rather than the one that was expected to because it's the oh yellow truck. There we go. The green truck's now leaving. What is going on? This race has been turned on its head. What is going on? Manor's now leading. We naughty. <laughs> well, the yellow truck's now lost. So, fuck that. We're going to try and get the green truck. Not a win, because we have to win. And what's that there? What's that? Are you, are you... Do you not feel so good? Do you not feel so good? <laughs> this is why I love this game so much. This is what they call emergent gameplay now. Basically arsing around and ma making your own fun. That didn't work. Oh, oh. Right. Blue truck's going for the lead. Send it. Yeet. <laughs> blue truck's like, get off. No. No, we've helped the blue truck into the lead. That's not what we meant to do. Fuck off, Lisa. No one likes you. Oh, yeah, there we go. <laughs> no, green truck, go on. Oh, my God, the yellow truck's making a comeback. This is the greatest race ever. This is what F1 needs. Does Lewis Hamilton pull a troll job? Just someone to become chaotic neutral in the race. Boing. Oh, bollocks. Yes! <laughs> yes! Right. Okay. Right. Go out in the lead and just leg it. Leg it. Run away. Oh, my God. The blue truck might be about to finish last. Oh, no. Oh, no. He's jostling. Some jostling for the minor positions. Yes! Yes! You got the blue truck to finish last. I am so petty. But I love it. I love it, Mangle. Right. Okay. I've just been sent a message on Instagram from a stranger that isn't complete spam. Anyway, not that you care about that. Right, we've got the win. And all of a sudden, Lisa has just been completely screwed over. Cob screw job. <laughs> the corner on the cob screw job. Right, it's this race again, which is the only one we won last season. So let's try and do that again. That'd be very useful. Oh my god. It fucks with my eye so much. Oh, now I want a biscuit again. I want a penguin biscuit again. Tell you what. Shall we try and fuck around with uh, Lisa again? Yes, there we go. Lisa's like, why do you hate me so much? Because I am chaotic neutral. And I hate things that are blue. I don't actually, I like blue as a colour. Very nice. Oh, bollocks. Oh, it's not penguin biscuit. It's a ning pin. <laughs> a ging, a ging pin. Uh, I don't know. God, the yellow car, you're so slow. You have to work really hard to keep the blue car behind you. To keep Lisa behind you. Oh my god, you are so slow. Go slower. Please. How slow is the green car? It's also quite easy to block on this track, though, so. There we go. Do, 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 do. Oh, sandwich. Oh, bollocks. Never liked apples. Yellow car, you are so slow. You are so slow. I don't, I don't know why I agreed to, like, try and get your win to rig this race for you. You are not helping yourself. Although, my blocking skills are just on point here. How s Be slower. This is, this is like trying to get Renault a Grand Prix win. By just blocking the Mercedes for the entire race. Oh my god, how, how slow do you want to be? I'm going to have to pass him on like the final corner. Come on, come on. Come on, you can do this, I believe in you. There we go. Just fuck over the blue car a bit more. Fuck over Lisa. 
Come on. You're tearing me apart, Lisa. I did not hit him. I did not. All right, go on. And then go. There we go. Yeah. We're just being petty at this point. <laughs> Lisa's just like, what is going on? Why is there a vendetta against me? Lisa's now third in points. Oh, my God. Right, this one is a horrible level. So I'm just going to win it and hopefully get promoted to Division 1. Bollocks, bollocks, bollocks. What is going on? The bollocks counter is off the charts already. And then where's the turn? Here it is. I think those those hob units, if you spend too much time on them, you get like melted and stuff. Well, not literally. That would be amazing if we had the graphical... This was sort of in the era of games where the graphics couldn't do much justice, so you imagined everything else for yourself. But like, so I always imagine if instead of just going and just being like put back, you, your your car actually like melted. Like, remember the Army Men games where they have a really cool uh, like melting animation when they use the flamethrower. One of my favourite part of those games. It's like whoop, 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 sort of bubbling away as it melted to death. Nice. That's a nice line through that corner. Totally legal as well. Bollocks. It's just give me the randomly shout out bollocks tutorial. Tutorial stri Oh no! I hate mushrooms. Those were not magic. Though, the top two are still pretty close if I remember rightly. So, just need to hit a perfect lap, which on this track is not possible. Oh my god, if I finish third, Lisa's least still going to win. No! It's not possible. It's not possible. Bollocks. No. I see. So the track cutting that I've done the last few laps was okay. That wasn't. Oh, wow. Lisa's already won. Oh, this is I mean, this is punishment for my hubris. Do we go into a, like, a tiebreaker race if we're level on points? We might do. The TK Grand Prix sponsored by MagicMushroom.com. Right. Yeah. Just give me the bad news about the points. Would Delora jump us in points, actually? Yes! We still won! We still won the championship! Because Delora had enough points to keep Lisa back. Oh, brilliant. So actually, our efforts in the last few races were not in vain. Right then, onwards to Division 1. It's also probably going to be a bit of a shorter stream than normal. Just because, you know what? It just goes that way. Turbo Blast. Oh, no. This is another one of those. We're going to set the AI, the car to be really, really fast. It's another one of those levels. Jesus Christ. That's so f so fast. If I remember rightly, isn't it? Just, no, it's not, a, it's not an oval. It's not an oval at all. Great start to my Division 1 campaign there. Uh, wait. <laughs> this is not going well. Have I taken a wrong turn? I have. It wasn't marked. It wasn't blocked off. I'm, I'm going to get lapped in a minute. Sound back. Sound I'm about to get lapped. No, I'm not having this. I'm not having this. I'm not getting lapped. Bollocks. I'm getting lapped. I'm getting so lapped. Because I got caught on a stray pixel on the corner of that building. Right, come on. Use the final few laps. Oh, go on. Get it. Oh, I'm just going to go down here. That's a line. It is a line, apparently. Wow. Well, that was a terrible start to the season. Terrible start to our Division 1 campaign. Ooh, the Tory's back. We can screw over the Tory, at least. Right, what, what car is the Tory in? Ironically, he's probably not going to be in a blue car this time. He is in a blue car. Brilliant. Oh, it's another helicopter race. <sighs> It always fucked me over the way it was down to go up. Like, yeah, maybe real life flying controls are like that, but it doesn't make any sense in a 2D top down based game. Like, I want to go up, so I press down. And there's nothing happening, it's just silence. So, uh, talk among yourselves. Although, we are threatening a comeback here. You have to get the button press, it's so precise. 
So they do that dickish thing of putting like pipes just beyond obstacles that you have to go up for. So you have to immediately go down again. Like that. And like that. There we go. Well, at least we're going to finish second. Planes! <laughs> Helicopters, at least. Let me chin. That's a bit of a strong reaction to finishing last. It's only a race. Then again, you did lose to a Tory, so I can understand that reaction. Pinball Panic! If I remember... No, this isn't quite the same layout as the track from Challenge Mode. No, it's not, because we're starting on the ball launcher thing, something. Oh, this is one of those races where one of the AI cars is actually faster than you in a straight line, so we've got to do this perfectly. Fuck off, Tory. Oh, there we go. We just punted the Tory off. And now gr Green is in second. Whoa. Bollocks. Bollocks. Pubes. Thank you. Bollocks. Oh, my God. They've saved some of their most evil tracks for the final division. Oh, we need to be on the comeback trail. Somehow, Green Car's still in the lead. Well, was. That's Chen. He's going to threaten to shoot himself again. Oh, my God. Get out of the way. You are not helping. I'm our best chance to defeat the Tories. Oh, my God. Lib Dem. Oh, my. <laughs> that actually worked out really well. I got smacked by one of the pinball flippers. Twatted straight back the other way. By the yellow car. That worked out quite nicely. Right. Can we pull off a comeback here? I don't think we'll be able to win the chat, win the division, but we will. We might be able to at least avoid relegation. There's some good good results here. I mean, getting lapped in the first race probably didn't help our cause. Oh, oh my God! <laughs> you are kidding me! <laughs> oh my God! You fucked up! You fucked up! You fucked up! Oh, that's brilliant! Oh my god, Jeremy fucked up. He got caught on the flipper. I think Chen might have punted him into it. Well done, Chen. Chen's actually gunning for the championship here. Oh no. This is potentially the most evil level in the game. Because it's raining. Oh no, this is not the one I thought it was. I think it's level... It's... The f <laughs> okay. It's the final level of uh, challenge mode, which is one of these tracks, but it's windy. This is just in the rain. So, there you go. And Jeremy's last, so that's nice. Oh, God. Sort of nice, sort of rhythmic raindrop sound. Mike, <laughs> Micro Machine's ASMR. Well, Jeremy's still last, so that pleases me. If I remember rightly, there's a hairpin up here. So Not the way I thought it was going. There we go. Can we still finish ahead of Jeremy? Is Chen going to win the championship instead? Be quite the comeback, given he was uh, last and threatening to kill himself after the second round. This is quite the turnaround. Chen is just like, I'm, I'm not doing this. I am, I am coming back stronger. I'm going to take down the Tories. <laughs> Meanwhile, I'm just trundling along in third. Oh no, Chen's not in the lead. He's battling for the lead. <laughs> no! Fuck off. Fuck off. Oh, Jeremy. Jez. You absolute Jez. You are not the Jez we like. You are not the Jez we need. You are the Jez we deserve, probably. Well, way to fuck that one up. <laughs> you can go this way or that way. I go neither. Oh my god. That is shortcut techers right there. Yes, I'll take it. Alright, well is Chen going to win the title? Or is whoever's in the yellow car going to win? Or are we going to win? Who knows? Hey, now he's back. Just in time to fi find out the thrilling conclusion of Division 1. With the Tory finishing last. Which amuses me greatly. That should mean Chen wins, right? Chen and Maria were tied. Oh my god. Chen wins on tiebreaker though. And the Tories relegated, which is lovely. And so we get Adina instead. And now I've actually had a chance to figure out the tracks. 
we uh, might be able to not be terrible this time around. Turbo Blast. All right, so Chen is in the blue car this time. But he's not a Tory, so we're good. All right, it was this race where we finished. We actually got lapped in this race. We did so badly. But this time... <laughs> Ignore those turns, because they're not the real ones. The game just decided to be really cruel and put fake turns in. Forget fake news. That's the real menace to our society. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, no. I think what really makes the championship interesting in this one is that the green car is actually the fastest AI car. I quite like it when sometimes... Because traditionally, it's like the blue car is the fastest AI car. The player is always the red car. And the green and yellow car alternate with being the shit ones. Whereas sometimes they'll randomly throw a curveball where, like, the yellow car is amazingly good. Ah, the blue car finished last. Hashtag fake turns. <laughs> well, Chen... well, this is what Chen did last time. He finished second. He finished last in the second race and then came back to win the title. So maybe this is what he needs to do to put himself in a hole early. Oh, no. This track needs to get in a hole. I've won at one track where I was shit at in last season. Down there we go. Play some elevator music. It'll be more entertaining than this race. Do do do. Yeah, this game's not perfect, folks. Like I say, it's probably uh, it's funny how it's pretty much vehicles that don't have wheels, which is where the game gets pretty bollocks. But there is one. Exceptions to that rule. Hopefully I'll be able to show it off at some point in the race. Uh, stream. Oh, that's close. There we go. I'm out in the lead. And you're getting banged, mate. And the helicopters don't have horns. Come on. That's how you know they're boring. Boring to, tr well, fly. Do, do, do. And, well, that was the thing. Kota. Need five points for a win. Should have called this stream Planes, Rains, and Automobiles. <laughs> Very nice. Like it. Uh, right, we're in, oh, now we're in the lead. The dominant lead. We have a legit shot to win the championship here. This is huge. This is huge. We've now got to navigate through the race where we were probably going to have a shit result last time. Except the AI screwed themselves over on the penultimate corner. And we're in the lead, though. Oh, not anymore. <laughs> By lead, it was all too brief. I, kn I never knew you... <laughs> oh, the blue car in this race and those flippers, it just doesn't like. You read a floor flipper. This is like Robot Wars now. Do, 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 do. Oh, my God. That blue car is so fast in a straight line, though. Chen is on the comeback trail. This is where his title tilt started last time. He's got... He's retaking the lead. <laughs> and then he got smacked by the flipper again. Oh, mate. Chen, mate. It's not going well. In fact, the green car's now up to second. Who's in the green car? I can't remember. Well, the green car is also faster than us in a straight line, so that'll make things interesting. It's also playing into a thing that I like in real motorsport that doesn't often happen anymore because BOP and must make everything equal and close. And Oh, shit. Oh, no, 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 no. Green car threatening to steal the win. And, oh, it's drag race to the line. And it was close, but we get the win. Nice. Caught the controller cable again. Oh, Chen was last again. Oh, wow. Could he be the first ever to go from champion to relegated? He could, you know. And we... 8, 9, 10... We've already locked up the championship. <laughs> oh, does that mean we have to see if we can try and fuck over Chen in this fight? <laughs> Send the reigning champion down to relegation. Well, I suck at this track in general, so maybe we could do that. Okay, yellow car is... <laughs> I was about to say yellow car's fucking off, and literally they did. They actually did. All right, so green car, now up second. Green car, blue car. Fuck. Oh, the green car's now fallen off. This is the tale of... I'm really fast! Whee! <laughs> I'm really fast out of crash. Like that. No! Chen's in the lead! No! No! We must screw him over. Now that we've locked the championship up. Bollocks. Imagine if this happened in Formula 1. Imagine. 
imagine if like Lewis Hamilton locks the championship up with like five races to go again. Just decides to troll the field real amount, real amounts in the final few races. Be really hilarious. Like deliberately just starts at the back or something every race. Oh god. Like what are you gonna do? Take the championship off me? I've already won it. The real solutions that the FIA needs to look at here to save F1. Bollocks! I need to actually look at doing that turn properly. Well, as it stands, our plan to humiliate Chen and get him relegated is just not working at all. Oh, but the leaders aren't that far away. We could still completely screw over Chen. Oh, someone's just fallen off. There's the yellow car again. Bollocks. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Right, and then... There we go. Nice. Oh, Chen is only in second. Bollocks! <laughs> I went to yeet him off the tree and it didn't work. That's a sentence that no one said before. Literally, no naught people have ever said that before. Right, well, Chen is probably going to finish second and potentially salvage his season. We're going to come home third and I think still win the title. <laughs> Well, Dina wins. Not a bad campaign from her, given she was freshly promoted. Oh, Chen survives relegation. But all the really matters is we are the Super League champions. And Chonk is the Super League champion. Having climbed up the table in some seasons, we get a nice trophy and that's it. Because this is an old game. We can view our stats. Wow. They keep stats for every player. Wow. For every character. There we go. One player league champion in seven seasons. There you go. I like that. Race has completed 23 in the challenge mode. Uh, oh, we could do some time trial, I guess. It's like Chonk is king. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. Right. Let's do some time trial because we can show off some tracks that we haven't shown off yet in the uh, single player modes. Right. And Chonk. Roller coaster. We've seen that one. We've seen Tiny Treehouse. Ferry fiasco. We'll get to that one. Basement bumps. I don't think we've seen so far. Chainsaw chase. We have garage games. We have water chase. Yeah. So you know what I was saying about about pretty much all the vehicles in this game that don't have wheels are absolute bollocks, except for one. This is that one. It's hovercraft racing, and it's basically infinite driftu. Because you're racing around on water. It's kind of amazing. Well, it's not amazing, but it's just funny. I mean, like, what did do? This is great fun to play multiplayer because the contact physics are brilliant. You can just ping someone completely off, kind of like that. But anytime you hit, you hit your opponent or hit the other car or the other hovercraft, I should say, hit the other craft, you just sort of ping off in different directions. It's brilliant. It's a shame there is only one hovercraft level in the game, I think. There's a turn around here somewhere. It's not there. There it is. No horns, though, which is disappointing. Whee! Boing. There we go. And you can just sort of bounce off the walls. It's kind of like pinball. It's, ironically, it's like the pinball track. It's all, oh, that's terrible. Hang on. Oops. <laughs> you can fall off that bit, apparently. Do-do-do. <laughs> Whee! There we go. Around there. In fact, I'm just wondering, is it worth doing head-to-head? -head? Because <laughs> the record was 4 minutes 59. Do the toilet seat level you mentioned. Oh, I did! Hydro Thunder. Two hours of full gameplay with no real repeats is great for Mega Drive. Yeah, it really is. Take a dump. Uh, no. Right, so I might actually do head-to-head -head now because I think... It's mostly the same tracks as challenge mode. And we haven't done it yet. Right, so training camp's the same. And we're up against Davey. Up against Dave. Right. You absolute da Oh, no, I remember now. Okay, so this is structured like traditional Micro Machines battles. So you have to get off the screen. Get off my screen. And, uh, yeah. As you can imagine, first few levels probably a bit easy. Yeah. So, this is pretty easy. 
was going to say, though, we are probably... I didn't think we'd make three hours with uh, a Mega Drive content... Mega Drive level of content, but we are ten minutes into the third hour, and we're now into head-to-head. -head. It's basically averaging out as one mode per hour at this point. All right, well, Dave, shit. Just go home. All right. Killer, killer. We're up against Dave again, for some reason. In fact, the first one we're going to beat him, I'm going to go... Oh god. Oh, I need to I need to stop winning. Oh god. Oh, I need to knock him off the side. <laughs> oh no! Oh, that's the close thing you gotta do. That's one thing you gotta be careful of. Fuck off. Fuck off. There we go! <laughs> Oh, it's so satisfying when that works. Oh, he changes. Oh, God. No! I was punished my hubris. Dave survives this time. Boop. There we go. The boop strat. Yes. The boop strat is always a winner. That's the boop strat, not the boob strat. I don't think I have a boob strat. What would a boob stripe? What a boob stripe? Answers in the comments, please. Oi. Oi. And <laughs> there we go. That's what I meant to do last round. Oh my god, actually, where I was fucking around on the first lap, we've got to be careful here because I think as it stands, we're going to go to overtime, which is sudden death. Yes, it's a playoff. We're off into a playoff series. And there's really awesome playoff music. Fuck you. <laughs> yes, the boob strategy works. Boob strat is a winner too. <laughs> yeah, we used the boob strat in that one. It works quite nicely. And Dave shit. Your shit. Ah. All right, can you stop challenging me now? Because you aren't a challenge. All right, sandcastles. I think for the most part, the races are the... It's Dwayne. Dwayne the Block Johnson. I think for the most part, the circuits are the same as challenge mode, but obviously different gameplay style. And uh, I think there are some different ones here and there. Well, this is going to be easy, isn't it? Um, I mean, your shit. Ah. Bollocks. Oh, close. I think you have lives in this one as well. I can't remember. Do, do, do. But this is like the classic thing that everyone associates with micro machines. The sort of get off the screen to win. Oh, God. oh no! I was punished my hubris. Whoops! Well, jumped, ramped over the blue car there. Ramped over Dwayne. I was mocking him by the end of that, really. Just mockage. Dwayne's <laughs> like, um, uh. What was what was it doing? Was I supposed to win that? Oh. Ah, there we go. We get the uh, extra life bonus mini game again. Where we eat the micro machines. This is kind of terrifying, really. We're just driving as micro machines. And now we're suddenly upgraded to this massive not micro machine and eating cars that we've just been driving. Nom, 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 nom. That one that always catches me out. Nom, nom, nom. There we go. Nom, nom, nom. <laughs> well, we've won an extra life for it. We've consumed their life force and energy. And now we're back to uh, Pinball Pursuit. Another pinball theme level. I didn't catch who our opponent was. Who was our opponent? Uh, some pleb. What I quite like is that this is a, multi this is a very multiplayer theme game. There's plenty of single player content. And the game is still fun even in single player single player so I like that looking at the various games that are around nowadays that are like single player what's that we're going off a DLC packs for weapon skins there 
Well, this is another easy race. Fuck it, we're going all the way in head to head. He says, knowing that the difficulty level is going to spike horribly sometime soon. Oh, fuck. Well, Chin got a point back there. That's Chin, our old, our old friend from uh, Super League. No one tell him that we tried to fuck him over and get him relegated. I mean, he's going to get relegated in a minute here. <laughs> oh, just brutal takedown into the wall there. Bollocks. Micro Machines is definitely one of those games where, like, sometimes it's not good to be the leader. I enjoy single player. Yeah, so do I. Fuck yeah, single player. Fuck you games that try to be like, no, you, you should have friends. Sometimes I don't want to human. Sometimes I don't want other humans around. I want to just play a video game. Can you imagine if books were like, no, nah, this is not supposed to be read by one person at a time. It's supposed to be read by a group of you all sitting around, passing the book around to each other. <laughs> there we go. Who's this? Who's our opponent for this one? Is it Suli? I think it is. Oh my god. He fell off there. Ow. Well, thanks for that. You just punted me closer to a point. Eventually. Where well, you have to get off the edge of the screen. Like, it's weird. This mode still works perfectly well in 3D Micro Machines games, but it had an added tension in 2D games, top down games like this. Because the closer you got to going off the screen, the more you couldn't see where you were going. Actually, I guess that's still prevalent in um, 3D Micro Machines games. Can we do it again? Yes! <laughs> the boob strat is two for two. Love it. Oh, <laughs> have some wine. Have a glass of wine. It will make you unwind. Boom, tish. Oh, what about... Ooh! Thought that was a turn that... <laughs> And Suli's blown it. Suli's just shit the bed. That's why she crashed off. She actually just shat the bed in the truck. Anyway, we move on. Ceiling circuits. I enjoy building games as well, like Sims and Roller Coaster Tycoon. Yes! I have the, like, Sims OG edition or whatever it was from... Uh, the, the first Sims, but like with all the DLC and expansion, not DLC, but expansion packs on uh, PC. I'd love to install it again one day, see if I can get it running. I've read so much time in that game. So much. And uh, meanwhile, I mean, you're terrible. Why are you, What are you even doing in this race? Why do you think you're worthy to race against me? Oh God, because I get lost. <laughs> That's the like, oh, he's fallen off. He's fallen off. I'll take the lead. Oh. <laughs> oh, he's got lost. I'll take the lead here. Oh, fuck. Or in his case, more. Oh, fuck. There's one of those cases of uh, it being a, a downside to leading. Get out, out of the way. All right, you pleb. Absolute pleb dong. Don't ask me what a pleb dong actually is. There's the... T fuck. I've blown it. Bruno, fucking Bruno Mars. Need for you. It's weird. The first few singles that Bruno Mars had, I just thought was saccharine and awful, and then he started putting out the absolute bangers like Locked Out of Heaven, and I'm like, no, I, I love this guy now. <laughs> Can all your music sound like that? And then there was stuff like, is it called Gorilla? It's the other super funky one he does. Right. Well, I'm gonna win. <laughs> I like that system. If you have more points at the end of three laps, it goes to a decision. So that was our first decision win. We didn't win that one by KO. We actually want, had one of them go to overtime. Imagine if that happened in UFC. It's got to a point. We've got a majority draw. The judges can't decide this. We need to just run an extra sixth round of this title fight. Oh, we have another one of these mini games. Where it gets cruel is where they start putting those cars off the screen. They start spawning them off the screen. So sometimes you're like, where the fuck is the next car? Oh, that's close. Oh, if I remember rightly, this it goes around in circles now, doesn't it? I think it does. I think the music starts getting faster. It's bollocks! We're not going to get this one. I don't think... Oh, we're definitely not going to get this one. Well, never mind. Yeah, this is the only way to get extra lives in this game. Do really annoying mini games. Not annoying, just mean. Right, well, we're up against Jethro Tull this time. 
on this level where it really, for some reason, it's really zoomed out. Not quite sure why. Fuck <laughs> off. Just punished Jethro there. Punished? Is that the... Oh, God. I like the fact that this track has walls as well, so you're just like, boing. There we go. <laughs> also, I think it's a lot harder. I think I've done this race against, like, my friend before. I've done this sort of head-to-head -head race against a friend of mine before. And we went the entire three laps without actually... We just stayed on the screen, the whole each other's screens the whole time. So it was a grand total of one point actually scored when we eventually, one of us fucked up in overtime. Overtime. Well, at the moment, we've already scored one point over Jethro, and that's all we've needed. Oh, we just snuck a second one. Well, we're definitely going to have to win this one by decision. But that's okay. Don't mind. Sometimes get boring fights sometimes. They can't always be... Uh, Justin Gaethje and Robbie Lawler hybrids. There we go. Point wins. Keeps his undefeated record at, what is it now? 7-0. and oh. We've not used any lives either. But again, as we found out earlier, you're going to have to stockpile them for the end of the game. Right. ATV action. Oh, we're up against Dave again. What is he doing getting another shot against the champ? I mean, really? The reigning Super League champion who's decided to not defend his title. Because fuck it. We've beaten Davey twice and they're our easiest races so far. What, has he gone away and improved? The trilogy fight that no one asked for. <laughs> well, this is um, a real challenge. How does it feel, Davey? How does it feel to be just way shitter than me? How does it feel? Bollocks. Can he be about to punish me for my hubris here? No. No, no, he's really not. I've seen that crisp ranking system and I'm like, what the hell? What crisp ranking system? Oh, bollocks. <laughs> David took advantage of our crisp banter. I was distracted. What is the official crisp ranking? It's a bit like that Dave graphic that was like ranking levels of biscuits and everyone was just like, well, it's clearly incorrect because you put chocolate digestive down the bottom. You put something like French French fancies or something at the top. I don't know, some some wank. <laughs> some some crusty wank was actually at the top of the biscuit. Oh god, there's a sideways jump there. Interesting strat. Yet to see the uh, World Rallycross Championship put up that side of that kind of obstacle. Oh yeah, I mean Davey, you're shit. You're shit. Ah. So Davey's about to go three and zero against us, or zero three, I should say. This is like Valentina Shevchenko being like, okay, but we're gonna have you fight Priscilla Casuera again. What, you mean the, the opponent I outclassed so badly I basically nearly murdered her in the cage? Yes. Okay. Well, I've nearly murdered her again. And I'm now 2-0 and against her. Oh my god! Oh my god! It's just car pinball. Oh, it nearly fell off. Davey nearly took advantage of that unpredictability there. Can Davey launch the most epic comeback ever? Uh, no. Uh, no. Oh, gold! Might sneak a point here. He will. Pringles are god tier in this ranking. I mean, Pringles are pretty good. Come on, Davey. What you, I mean, what you can do? What you can do? Just mocking him at the moment. I'm like that guy against CM Punk in his last fight. He was just sitting there, just like, come on then, punch me. Punch me, bro. I'm just like, I could punch you right now, but I'm not gonna. And then he got fired himself for just not doing anything. All right, well, anyway, Davey's own three. Shit, Chris, no fan. Right, so we now advance our professional record to 8 No, It's Dwayne again! We beat even easier than... Actually, this was where the AI... The blue AI... Can you get out of the way, please? We're actually faster than us, so... Oh, that's really not the case this time. That's not the case. But the performance gap is a lot closer. Oops, that's not where the turn is. There we go. And then that's not the turn is where the turn is either. Oh my god, is this going to be another one of those... Uh, Oh, there's always a there we go. We finally got a point. One of those tracks where, you just as you're about to get off the screen, there's a turn. And you're like, no! Oh, go on. All right, where's the turn? There it is. Okay, that's way around the turn. Yes, there we go. <laughs> nice. The accidental boob strap. Now I don't know what the accidental boob strap would be, but the accidental boob strap you just saw. Oops. Come on. Come on. Come on. Bollocks. Bo this could be really annoying if 
that if neither of you fuck up for the entire three laps, you're just going on forever. Just into overtime, just like five minutes later. Anyone fucked up at all? Nope. Right, we're now 9 0, though. And I think we, yes, we get another chance at the extra life mini game. Now, because we didn't pass this level part last time, we will get to do it again, which is nice. Doop, 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 doop. Doop, doop, doop. Bollocks. Oh, don't respawn me pointing at the water. That is mean. Oh, that's just fucked it now. All right, if I remember rightly. Oh, my God. This is one of those mini games where if you fuck up once, you just completely just go. It all just falls apart. We got 25 last time, and we're going to get 26. We got one more. We got 27. Well, we technically got 28. We basically got 27. Never mind. We don't need another life. We still haven't lost a race. Right, we're now up against Dwayne again. Damn, Micro Machines. Back at it again with more unwanted trilogy fights. Oh, hang on. Is Dwayne actually faster than us in a straight line, though? The power unit wars. Might be. He is! <laughs> but, uh, you know, still can't drive it, can you? Oh, that was close. <laughs> we can just do that. Oh, God. Okay, this is going to be close. Fuck! Right, Dwayne, you win this round. Bollocks! I completely backfired. Oh, no. All right, okay. Yeah. Oh, swerved away. <laughs> Engines are making weird noises here. No. Please. Yes, there we go. Finally, we got a point. All right, hang on. Let's see if we can do this. Oh, no. Yes, there you go. <laughs> we do not have the speed advantage, but we do have the cunning advantage. I thought Dwayne was going to fall off on all his own there. Right, you go past. Oh, no. That was a bad move. That was a tactical error. There's the end of the straight. Oh, <laughs> fuck it ourselves anyway. Okay, this is a close race. There you go. Just have to use a little bit of smarts here. Oops. Oh, no, 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 no! Oh, save that one with an accidental shortcut strat. Whee! Oh, God. Nice. Just use that speed to my advantage. It's like being a bullfighter, basically. Yes, there we go. All right, we now cling to a slim lead. Halfway around the final lap. You what? You what? Oh, no! Uh, right, well, we're back level again. Yes, there we go. <laughs> Snuck a point. This is the true spirit of Micro Machines now. Don't beat your opponent with skill. Beat them with just absolute carnage. Like that. All right, you're going down. You're going down, fam. Yes! The boob strap worked again. Oh. <laughs> oh my god, it's the simple boob strats, the oldest tricks that are the best. Go on then, try and beat me across the line, you're not. Yes! <laughs> As a red ball just slowly rolls past. Hello, Meowzebub. Nice user, that's quite a nice username. This game looks good, yeah, it really is. This is my first ever racing game that I ever played in my life ever, when I was like four or five or something. It's Micro Machines 2 Turbo Tournament, and it is awesome. Meaning, oh, We're up against Chen this time. I've got a terrible start, because I'm sipping water, as you do. Stay hydrated, kids. Oh my god. Is the AI, is the AI truck faster again? Well, it might be. Very hard to keep up. No, it's a little bit slower, but I'm going to have to be very careful in this one. The difficulty level in this one is just like, piss easy, piss easy. Right, you've 
proving yourself to be competent in this game. Fucking Dark Souls. Uh, that's basically the difficulty options. It's like in Doom or something where it's just like... It goes from Don't Hurt Me Daddy to Full Ultra... Vi um, I Am Death Incarnate. Like, there's no middle ground. Alright, well, we've not conceded any... Bollocks. Just about to say, we haven't conceded any points. And then we did. So we need to rectify this very quickly. <laughs> nice. Spotted. No, there's no, no turn there. Oh, come on. Yes. That was just a gimme, to be honest. There we go. Sometimes when the AI just sit there, it's like they're teasing you. Like, come on, do you dare? And it's surprisingly easy to still fall off nonetheless. Surprisingly easy. Probably shouldn't be a surprise at this point. Oops. Oh. <laughs> Accidental boob. Oh, bollocks, bollocks. Alright, stay calm. Come on, come on. Stay calm. We're good, we got this. No! Stop hitting cutlery. Stop twatting yourself on cutlery. Not a good strat. Come on, come on. Come on. The AI truck takes that same line through this straight down here. It's good to decide the race. He's not gonna, though. Chen does not take that line. I think this is going to go to overtime because I can't see where I'm going to get a point against him otherwise. Unless I fuck up. Oh god, that was close. Alright, shortcut. Yes. Y no! Cubes. Come on, come on. Oh no! Fucked up the boob strat! No! Okay, we're still in it though. Oh no, 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 no. And we're into a overtime. In the lowest scoring race so far. Oh my god. Chen takes that line down the back straight again. Oh god. Oh god. No. No, he doesn't. There we go. Come on. 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 Yes. There we go. We had to grind out that win. We haven't conceded any bollocks. You're right. Thoughts and prayers. The worst college micro machines game. <laughs> the NCAA micro machines tournament finals. All right, we're up against Cherry this time. I played Micro Machines One. The sequel looks awesome. Really? What console was that on? Oh dear. Well, the AI in this one are terrible. So I'll just spawn through the tube of wallpaper. <laughs> Oops. I think the AI go at the both go at the same speed, don't they? This one, hang on. Yep, equally matched top speed. So it's all about the Ponterino this time around. <laughs> okay, or you can just veer drunkly around. Nez, nice. That's awesome. <laughs> Whereas this AI car is just being so shit. Jerry, you are you drunk? Jerry, are you drunk? Here, let me. Let me sort you out there. I nearly got a point. I nearly won. Oh my god, am I going to... Yes! I'm going to win before the end of the first lap. Oh, wow. Yeah, you will like it around here, Meowsy Bub. We are mostly a retro gaming channel. It probably seems like a good time to remind you that if you want, if you like what we do, you can follow us on Twitch and get notified when we go live next time. And you can also subscribe to us on YouTube under the same name, uh, which is where we put all the VODs up of our streams. I'm just having to focus a little bit here because this one is the third attempt, a third attempt at this horrifically difficult mini game challenge. Come on. Bollocks, 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 bollocks. Basically, if you miss one of these, you, you can't do it. Oh, come on. Might still be able to do it. Come on. Yes! There you go. Nice. But yes, continuing my plugging, you can follow us um, on Twitch and subscribe to us on YouTube. You can also subscribe to us on Twitch if you want to. And there's also a Streamlabs donate link down there, should you want to support what we do. And the time limit is as tight as Simpsons hit and run. It really is. Oh, we're up against the Tory again. Probably he's in blue car. So, fuck you, Tory. Screw you. Bollocks. Oh, that's not good. And I think we are faster than the AI in this one. I 
think we are. Oh, God. Not if we take those lines, though. I meant in straight line. Avoid the pong of doom. The niff of doom from the toes. Sticking out the sand. Yeah, I think we are slightly faster than the... Where am I going? Interesting line for that corner, AJ. But it sort of worked. <laughs> Jeremy... <laughs> No. Oh. Right, come on, focus. You need to get that point. Come on. Yeah! The sand speed ramps helped us there. The thought didn't know I was coming. Is it really an armbar? If I'm, if we do a stream on Armbar Arcade's Twitch, and, bl <laughs> and Black and Wild doesn't say thought in chat, was did it ever happen? Oh my god, we can't let, we can't let our first professional, oh my god, it's the final lap. Fuck, we need to... Get a point. Come on. Yes, there we go. We can't let our first loss of head to head mode be against the Tory. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Yeah, there we go. I like how sometimes the sound glitches out in overtime, so it still goes. Arrgh. In Micro Machines 1, some characters were just better than the other in certain game modes. For example, Spider was faster in motorboats. Interesting. I don't think there's any character characteristics, uh, stats, or traits or anything in this one. And we're up against Jethro again. That's a nice, nice feature. Yeah, it is a nice feature, actually. Micro Machines was kind of forward-thinking in a lot of ways. Right, which... Oh, it's the piano. Oh, bollocks! <sighs> do, do, do. Oh, much better accelerating my truck, anyway. Well, oh, God. Left and then right and then yep there we go more chicanes. Yep there we go. I'm just take the first lap to remember the track. Simultaneously running up the keys on the piano and bye. <laughs> All right, so we're back level on points. Oh, <laughs> went for the Ponzerino, did not work. Punished my hubris there. Good thing this isn't like instant knockout or anything. Oh boy! <laughs> okay, we both fucked each other over there. <laughs> but it still somehow worked. If you do ever start having a swear job for the bollocks, you might find yourself bankrupt one stream in. Oh bollocks! It seems to be this one. It brings the bollocks out of me. Yeah, I did say that. Moving on. Right. This absolute chodemonger is somehow leading. Because I've been bollocks so far in this race. <laughs> so Jethro says, I'm going to shit the bed as well. Whee! That looks like fun. Being terrible looks like fun. And down the keyboard. And then round here. Oh, that's not worked at all. That's not worked at all. Where are you going? Chodemonger. I mean, where are you going? Oh, nice. Wide line coming into the fight and into that corner, though. I respect that strategy. You know, I don't respect your talent as a driver, but I respect that strategy. Oh, bollocks! These are not good cars to yeet in, I've decided. Kids, do not yeet in monster trucks. Not a good idea. Is this finally poised here? Still only a point in it. And Jethro has decided to stop, stop fucking up now. It's annoying. Do you mind fucking up once more? And the sound glitched out. Yes! Yes, 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 yes. Come on. No, 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 no! Okay. We, uh, this is going to go to overtime, I think. Oh, shit. I know where the track goes. Uh-oh. Here we go. We're going to overtime again, boys. We are into overtime. The tension is real. Jethro's back in the lead. Come on. Come on. Get out. All right, do a fuck up. Yes, 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 there you go. Oh, another close one. Just a swear jar on the arcade in general, be able to buy DPI. The keyboard drive is awesome. It really is. Some of our beatdowns are fun. <laughs> yes. Oh, no. Oh, God, it's this one. We're up against Delora, a new opponent. All the... 
Oh. Well, the AI car is actually faster than us. Yes! Yes! <laughs> I love being an absolute dick in this game. It's wonderful. Uh, where's the turn? Here it is. Yep, there we go. <laughs> the boop strat works lovely on this on this track. Do you want to just do you want to crash there? there? Oh no! Ah, come on! <laughs> fell off. What is going on? The absolute hacks, bollocks! It's not going well. Right, okay. Let's not get cocky now. Way there we go. Absolute chonk. Yeah, there we go. There we go. That's how you do it. Alright, let's try and do the boop strat again. There we go. <laughs> Just transmit the speed through there. Thank you, Meows above. That's very kind of you. Oh, come on. All right, we just need to maintain this lead for the final lap, which means we won't. Oh, do we go for the yeet? Do we go for the yeet? Yes! Oh, it didn't work. But at least Delora didn't get a point. Oh, no! <laughs> Turning a drag... Yeah, exactly. There we go. Ah, there we go. <laughs> That's still a bit of boot track to win the race. Have you followed us, by the way, Meowzebub? Please do. If you, if you like what we do, of course. Oh, another extra life mini game. Oh, no. Bollocks. The detection in this one is really not nice. That, you know, you know what I said earlier about how it starts spawning cars off the screen? Oh, why would you do that? You'd have to be a really cruel person. It's like NASCAR. Oh, speaking of which, that's Dora again. The rematch. I'll see if the boob strap works again. Bollocks. Oh, the slide job works, though. Oh, my God. Weaving side to side on the banking. Whoa. Slide job. Oops. Oh, God. Where am I going? <laughs> Some absolute Ponterino here. Oh, yes. Yeah, there you go. Now we're off the screen, too. Oh, bollocks! No! The boob strat didn't work. Whoa, there we go. This one's going to go to overtime as well, by the look of it. Come on, can we get the point? No! I'm going to overtime again. Yeah, there we go. Well done. Edge of the seat stuff. It really is. You clinch your butt just watching. How do you think I feel? Right. Well, Dolores 0-2 against us now. So she really just needs to sort off now. Well, Emilia's here now. Oi! Oi! Right, you. Laying down the challenge early. And the 17 race win streak we got going. But do you mind? Do you mind? He's stealing some of my tricks here. It's absolute pleb. Bollocks! Ah, never mind. Right. You. Get banged. <gasps> Don't know what that was. A hiccup or a scream of terror. It was a screams... Screams inwardly. I was screaming on the ins... I was screaming on the inside. Bollocks! Uh, right, this is not going well. So, I think what we need to do is just fuck you off. There we go. <laughs> That's what we need to do. 
Still no Dirt Rally 2. Yeah, you've noticed Black and Wild. Well, at the moment, the way I've got the stream set up, I can't fit my wheel in anywhere, so... <laughs> Hands tied. Oh! Avoided the gap in the fence there. Very close. But we got the point anyway. So it worked. Did a good turnaround. Oh, nearly knocked him off. Nearly. No plus. There we go. Plus no. Plus no Ponterino. Come on. Come on. Come on. Let's turn down here. Oh! Needs a wheel anyway to turn a car. I don't. Oh! Nice. The boop strat has worked. No, it hasn't. Please, please don't go into overtime again. Please. Please, can we get a point? Yes! Oh, that was so close. We were about to blow off the roof. Come on. Right. We're a point ahead. Yes, come on. Oh, can we hit him in the air? Yes! 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 <laughs> Oh, I'm such a dick in this game, and I love it. This is one of those games, way before the GTA games came along, where it was so much fun to be a twat. Oh, and there's the finish line, and we're going to win. We've protected our unbeaten streak. We've still got 13 minutes to go. Right, yeah, well, Emil, nice try. But, uh, you're banged. Good night. We've still got a load of lives as well. We might be able to complete challenge mode. Head-to-head -head mode, I mean. Oh, Davey's back. This absolute knob cheese is back. Has he got a faster AI car than us, though? Fast car in a straight line. He does. Okay. So d <laughs> Just use a keyboard and mouse. Use a joystick. That's the real strat. Oh, bollocks. Hang on. Oh, that didn't quite... Oh, no, no, no. There's a turn there. There we go. There you go. Use the boob strat. It. Oh no. Nay, you were saying to me last night how dead the Joe Tackett memes are. Oh god, no, come on, come on, come on. Yes! <laughs> we're not gonna we're not gonna win on outright speed, but we're gonna win on outright cunning. And not by doing that. Come on, come on. Ooh. Come on! So close. <gasps> I was so close. All right. Boop strat. No. Didn't work. Yes, it worked. <laughs> I think there's Emil and Spider. Is Emilio from Micro Machines 1 in this game or Spider? I don't know. Haven't actually played that much uh, Micro Machines 1. Scandalously enough. Oh, we got another uh, mini game. Oh, extra life game. I like how the races are so quick in this one. Like, they barely last more than like a couple of minutes at a time. Oh, bollocks. Probably means I've lost it. Basically, if you miss one of them... I mean, that's just evil. Why would you do that? Why would you do that? I mean, why? Why would you spawn these obstacles off the screen? Bollocks. I'm off. I give up. The Joe Tackett memes are fucking dead. I agree. How's this Joe Tackett himself? <laughs> I don't know that. Oh, it's Cherry. Cherry gone back. Oh no, it's the boop level. The ultimate boop strat. Nice. There we go. Come on. Yes, there we go. Got a point in before booping. Everything about Tackett is done. Nope. Oh god. No! Yes! <laughs> Thank you, Boop. Oh, no! I hate the xylophone. Shittest instrument ever. Oh, where am I going? Ugh. Anyway, all right. Oh, back here. All right. This is what I meant to do. Yes, that's what I meant to do. Yes! <laughs> Nearly gave Cherry the ultimate shortcut. But I didn't. Because I'm that good. Do, do, do. Oh no, more boopage. Oh, we both survived this time. We survived this. Oh! <laughs> yes! The boop strat will always be cheap as fuck, and I don't care. Oh. Cherry adjusting her line that time. 
Uh oh. Oh, yes! Cherry got boobed that time. Nice, okay. So there are a few characters recurring from Micro Machines 1. Please don't, please don't boop me this time. Please don't boop. Please no boop, booperino. There we go. Bollocks! <laughs> Cherry, Walter, Dwayne, Jethro, Amelia, Amelia and Spider are all back from uh, Moon 1. <laughs> and Cherry, you can just get banged. M9. Oh, yeah. Some absolute boopage. Yes, there we go. A dominant win there. Didn't even need a decision win there. Didn't win decision or over. Didn't need decision or overtime. Nine minutes to go. How much further can we get in head-to-head -head mode? We are on race number twenty. I thought that said tosser trouble for a second. Oh, there's Violet, Mister. I want to call Mister. Billy Idol cosplayer. Oh, we're dead even in terms of top speed. Can't remember the layout of this track though. Boop strat. Whoops. Not the right time for the boop strat. It was a tactical error. Boing. Doesn't it go left in a minute? It does. And then left again, if I remember rightly. Bollocks! I was still on the ground! It's like they're playing it upside down. Bollocks. Oh no. Right, come on. Oh, bollocks. All right, we're two points down at the end of the first lap. We can bring it back, though. feel confident-ish. Jumping over the toaster. Jumping over the crust. Oh, no! No! Oh, my God. Our opponent nearly profited from an absolute fuck-up. Come on. Oh, this is so tense. Bollocks! Uh, I hate the little obstacles in this race because they just smack you. They're all solid and they all just ping you back so much. No! Completely didn't work. Right, we've eaten our first loss, but we've still got some lives. We've got literally some lives. Yeah, whatever. Our undefeated streak comes to an end at 19. How many lives have we got? Five. Okay, so we've made this part with five lives. Five alive. Right. Tosser trouble. We are having trouble with the tosser. Right. Bootstrap is going to have to come out here, I think. Maximum bootstrap. Oh, he's fucked up. You fucked up. You fucked up. Oh. oh, bollocks! No! no! Oh. Balls! <laughs> ah. This is making me make all sorts of noises here. Not good ones, either. Anything round? Come on. Well, that's just absolute chode, isn't it? Boing, 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 boing. It's not that he's faster than us in a straight line. As you can see, it's just he's really good at most of the corners. Except when he's not. He's either perfect or fucks up. <laughs> As if I can talk. Come on. Come on, the tension is real. Oh, God. Oh, my. Wow. The bread has now screwed me over. I normally like bread. Oh, you... No! That's just... Uh, that's so annoying. Yes. Yes, there we go. Revenge. Can we do the bootstrap here? Can we do the bootstrap? No. Bootstrap! Come on. Bollocks. Yes, there we go. Bootstrap was successful. 
We are still behind, though, I think, on points. Yeah, we are. We need to rectify this. Not by doing that. Not by doing that. If I could react like a second later, I'd be in sync with the... Yeah, there is a weird thing where the... Oh, this is chode. This is absolute chode. Yeah, where it's it's almost like the Elgato is slightly ahead of the uh, video and the and the microphone audio. Oh, there we go. Right, that's how we do it. Okay. Can we engineer a dramatic comeback here? Bollocks! That's a no. Yes! No! There we go. Oh my god, this could still be a dramatic final lap. Presented by Credit One Bank. Bit of bootstrap there. No! No! Why? Whoops. No, 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 no. <laughs> Fuck. This just hasn't worked. This just has not worked. Okay, so we've lost another life to uh, Billy Idol Plebo over there. All right, come on. Third time lucky. Believe in yourself. Yeah, eat your steering wheel, whatever. Come on. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, whatever. There we go. I'm not saying Billy Idol's bad, by the way. Absolutely not. Yes, the boop strat. Oops. Bollocks. Bo oh, no. You. Oh. Yes. The yes, there we go. The boop strat did work. Excellent. Yes! Oh, the boob track is working so well. It's a nice day for a boob track. I hate this level so much. Just hit one obstacle and it just completely kills all your momentum. Ah! <laughs> Fell off. Okay, come on. We're only two points away from a win here. We can do this. Come on, come on, come on. I believe. I believe. Don't throw this away, Johnson. Come on. Oh, come on. Turn it three right at the at the bread. <gasps> Speaking of bread. Oh my god. I normally like toast. Oh, go on, get it. Bollocks. Oh. Ah! The sauce nearly saved us. Come on, can we get a bootstrap? Nope. Are we still a point ahead? Ah! We're not anymore. <laughs> you can tell this is the same company that eventually made Dirt Rally 2.0, can't you? Alright, come on. Yes! There we go, we've got a point back. Come on, come on, this is so tense. This is tension like video games just don't. Ever have. Ever. Yes! Yes! Alright, come on. Keep it up, AJ. Come on. Keep it up. Use those old instincts. You can do this. Oh, hang on. Can we f Bollocks! It didn't work! Okay, you still got a point up. Still got a point. It's fine. We're good. Oh, you. Ah! Salt cubes! Right. Else for it. We're gonna have to. Yes! We died together! But of course, he gets restarted in front of me because absolute hacks of this game. We're going to overtime, aren't we? We are so going to overtime. Or is it time for one last. Damn it! Couldn't get the right line on the bootstrap. So, we're gonna have to activate the. No, okay, we're gonna have to be patient. There we go. Come on. Yes. Yes! The boob strap worked. KDST on San Andreas had White Wedding. Yes. It did. Was that the one that was presented by Axel Rose? As someone else, obviously. All right. Testicle chase. Here we go. We're up against Spider this time. Okay.
Ow, do you mind? Bop. <laughs> okay, we both fell off. <laughs> well, that really worked, didn't it, AJ? There you go. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Finally, we're on the board. Whee! There we go. Because if you didn't know, all uh, pool and snook tables have all their holes co connected up. But... By, uh... You can, you can actually go from hole to hole. Yeah, there's a word I just said. Annoyingly, because the cue ball's already gone. I couldn't fuck him over around there, but... Let's just outdrive him. How hard can that be? Oh my god, the AI... He fell off as well. It's fine. Oh, here we go. It's got to be a chance for a point. Come on. No! Ooh. Bollocks. Bollocks. We're still in it. We're still in it. Still in the point. Still in it. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, come on. Get it. Right. Fuck him over. F oh, no! The poop strat did not work. We're still in it, though. This, this would be so close without those early fuck, early fuck ups. Oh no! No! Stupid bit of wood. Right, we're gonna have to go full on aggro on the final lap here, aren't we? Except he's just gonna fuck off now, isn't he? Oh goodbye. <laughs> Come on, here we go. Come on. Yes, there we go. We got a point back. This will be the greatest comeback in history, potentially. It's not. It's not going to be. Yes, come on. Oh, another point. We've, got, we've literally got two turns to go. If we pull this off. No, we're not. <laughs> if we pull this off, which we're not. <laughs> Honk. Go from hole to hole. Very good. Right. Come on, I'm determined. We can do this. We've still got some lives left. I'm amazed we filled a full three hour stream with micro machines with a Mega Drive game. It shows you how good this game is. And it kind of proves what I said earlier about how much I was able to sink so much time into this game when I was younger. No! I hate you. Spider, know that I hate you. He's probably like, I know. Fuck off. There you go. Oh, come on. Oh. Yeah. Spider chong. Spider chong. Yes, there we go. Nice. We're back level. This is going to be close. Bollocks. No. No, 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 no. Okay, we're back. There we go. Back level. There we go. Yes. <laughs> Mugged him off for the point. Oops. <laughs> Please let this straight end. I mean, game, what was the point of that? Come on. It was a small jump I found. And you decided to screw me over. Come on, we can do this, though. We can do this. I believe. I believe in miracles. I believe in the boop strat, which hasn't worked. I'm very fast through here, though. Oh, come on! How was that not a point? <sighs> Stupid. <sighs> right. No. hate this game. hate this game. Hate it. Hate it. Hate... No, I don't. But it is an old game, so it has that element to it. Come on. We've got lives. We can do this. One life left. Come on. We can do this. Come on. Breathe deep. We can do this. We can do this.
We're just going to lose a point going down this straight, aren't we? No, we're not. No, we're not. Yes! Oh, oh no, 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 no. Stay in it. There we go. Okay, we're still in this. Just. Just about. Yes. Okay, come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, yes. All right, the handling section of the track is our strength. Yes, there we go. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, come on. Right, handling has to be our strong section of the track for us because we have no choice. There we go. Oh, come on. We can do this. I believe. Whoop. <laughs> That's just my line through that corner now, apparently. It works. Not complaining. Oh, go on. Get it. Yes! Oh my god, are we going to win this before three laps are up? Is that actually going to happen? Oh my god, the cue ball bounced back down. I didn't know it did that. Fucking hell. Yes! Suck it. We're doing the Nick Diaz. Oh. Not surprised, motherfucker. Yeah, look at you there. Look at you there. I've got a, I've got a hand gesture for you as well, Spider. Winrar. Oh no. Oh no. I've now got one life left. You must lead it. <laughs> what a great start. What an amazing start that was. Alright, I'm fully back on my bullshit now. There we go, and it works. Fully back on my bullshit now. Because it because guess what? It works. Oh, no. Going this way now. No. Oh, yes! <laughs> Brilliant. That's not a shortcut. You never knew that was a shortcut before, but it is now. There we go. Oh no! It's not straight. Still up by a point though. Still up by just a point. Yes! There we go. Well, we are now. <laughs> oh! Come on. Two thousand years later. Oh. oh, that just hasn't worked. Well, not for me, anyway. Oh, these... oh God! <laughs> so close. So close. Alright, come on. We're back level. We're doing alright. Right, there is a turn here. You have to remember that. There we go. Yes! Oh, the boob strat! Will forever work for us. Oh my god, the glitching horn noise. Jesus Christ. Okay. Yes! <laughs> oh, good. Oh, goody! Whoops. <laughs> I have to go catch it on the end of the VOD. Thank you for hanging out with us tonight, Super Mike. Yes! <laughs> That's what I was hoping to do the whole time. This game is so satisfying. <laughs> come on, come on. Time for some punterino. Oh, I nearly punted her off. <laughs> oh, come on! Came just like, no, let's just give her a point. Because apparently now you are track cutting too much, but it doesn't matter. Just got the got the point back anyway. Boop strat. Boop strat! There we go. <laughs> and the horn noise from the traffic just glitched out. How much further can our one life take us? Uh. We made it to 24. We made it to the penultimate race in uh, challenge mode. We're now at race 23. We're against Lisa. You damn you, pod, Lisa! Bollocks! <laughs> always funny if you can get the two of you to respawn on that hilly section because yeah you just sort of crawl crawling in my skin oh my god where am i going this is not where the track goes aj yes oh no oh, no these cars have no grip don't they no 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 funny thing is i don't think the ai car is actually faster in a straight line oh there we go got a point 
all the way back here. Oh, fuck. It didn't work. We are way faster in a straight line, but I'm, I'm wondering if the blue car handles a lot better. That might be how they've equalised this one. Oh, my God. Get ready for prime bootstrap. Okay, no, don't. Okay, then don't. Yes! <laughs> that worked so perfectly. Oh, my God. Oh, here we go. Slowly crawling. Oh, shit. Just me moving around slightly cost me so much momentum. Oh, but the boob strat, ever reliable. Ever reliable. The old faithful, the old favourite. See ya. Oh, bollocks. Oh, no. Oh, no. Ah, the boob. Oh, go on. Get it. Ah. I nearly survived that one. Ah, micro machines. Never change. Come on, come on. Oh, get it. Get it. And come on, get the point. Get the point. There we go. Can we make it to the final race, which is just an absolute dick of a race? Oh. <laughs> it's like, excuse me. Excuse me. <laughs> come on, focus. You clearly have the faster car here, so... Right, let's see if we can do the get the boob strap working this time. Oh no! It didn't work! Oh! Yes! Yes! <laughs> Did work in the end. Although, kind of didn't. <laughs> Don't be tempted to go for the punt. I have. Oh god. Oh no. No, 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 no. There we go. <laughs> Punt. Maximum Punterino. Yes, there we go. Oh, br <laughs> it's a little nudge on the hill. There we go. Oh, go on. Is another nudge going to win us it? Yes, well, nearly. Nearly win us it. Come on. Come on. I love the fact that this is like the third to last race in head to head mode. And they've just decided, yeah, this is, you know, to give you one of the slowest cars in the game as an opponent. Like, really? Okay. You uh, you want to do that, I guess. Be my guest. Maybe they're like, just soften you up for the... Well, someone heard me saying that. Alright, we just get around the next corner. Skate! One more boob strap. <laughs> Didn't work. Pro Street strats. Well, give a shit AI at the end of the, the end of the uh, career mode. Now the Pro Street strat, nay, would be to give a shit AI for the entire game. Right, well, we made it as. Oh no, we got a three win bonus mini game thingy, Bob. Oh, <sighs> Which I've already failed. <laughs> Such is the difficulty level on these things. Oh, why would you do that? Why why would you do that? Oh, well, I've got 27. A vague improvement. But just game, just stop wasting. I really needed that hell as well. Oh no, it's the terrible oh, The terrible helicopters one. Okay, away we go. Attention. Oh bollocks. Oh, okay, we're good, we're good. We are faster than the AI helicopter in a straight line. It's just we have to use the right strats. So if you weren't here earlier, the uh, trees are... You have to go under the tree bits and over everything. It Not like that. Get to the chopper. Indeed. Oh, that was a good run. That was a good line through there. All right, next one's a tree and then up and down. There we go. Come on. Yes! There we go. We got the point back. We might actually make it to the very fi final stage in this one. I feel confident. Now that I know how to fly a helicopter in this game, 
Bollocks. No, I don't. Yes, I do. Oh, come on! That was a legitimate shortcut. There we go. Well, it's level on the final lap. Sponsored by Credit One Bank. Oh, come on, come on, come on. We're now in the lead. Uh oh. Yes. 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 Come on. We are so close. Come on. Come on. Yes. There we go. We're going to the finals. We are going to the finals of head to head with one life left. Oh, God. Oh, man. Nice to. Yep. This one's evil. You remember the treehouse levels we've had already? Final showdown with Spider. Yeah, this one has wind to contend with. You see? So you're constantly having to correct for being blown in one direction. Not blown by one direction. That's completely different. Oh, I survived! <laughs> oh my god. Tension is real. We're being blown off the track! And I think... I don't know if the AI cars... That's even, no! Yeah, that's the worst bit, trying to turn on that last corner. So, what we have to do instead is... Do that. <laughs> even to the very last race in head-to-head -head mode, the boob strat's still working very well for us. No, now we're leading. It's not a good thing. You lead the way. Because you, you've got to somehow account for the fact that the wind is, like, there, it's pushing against you, and then here it's constantly moving <gasps> to the right. So this corner is really evil for that, so you have to turn really early. Not that early, of course. Yes, there we go, although that works. How much more can the boob strap work? Oh, it nearly clinches the point. Be careful there. And not do that. Oh my god. This is tense. This is so tense. Ah! Ugh. Come on, we can still do this. We can still do this, I believe. Ah! Oh, no! Ugh. It's all fallen apart on the final lap. Yes, there we go. Can we pull off the greatest comeback ever? Arguably not. Debatable, I would say. But... Oh, no! <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh, never mind. I'm proud that we got all the way to the final level of head-to-head, -head, though. Fucking hell. Also went, like, an hour and 18 minutes longer than I thought we would with this game. But, um, that'll wrap it up for tonight, I think. Oh boy, it's been so much fun revisiting the first ever racing game I ever played ever in my life, ever. So close, it really was. <sighs> Those old techers from back in the day, five-year-old five me would be proud. The techers did not go to waste. Full stream, thank you Meowzybub, that's really nice of you. Thank you for everyone that's hung out with us tonight. This was a nice little birthday special stream, I mean my, my birthday's in two days, and Nay streaming on my birthday. Which is nice. So I might just tipsy wander into chat and be like, Hey, it's my birthday! Who's this pleb? Um, so but this was a nice one to revisit. It's definitely a charming game. It really is. I love the fact that it's still so fun. Like, the experience hasn't aged at all or anything. It's still there. Thank you, Meowzy Bell. Thank you. Um, so yeah, it's been so much fun to revisit it. It's just as frustrating and just as super massively fun. Super massive happy fun time. As I remember it from my uh, my youth. The uh, the rose-tinted spectacles, in fact, were clear all along. I didn't need to tint them. So, that will do it for tonight. Thank you guys so much for hanging out. And if you haven't already, please do follow us on Twitch so you will be notified when we're going live. Next next stream will be Wednesday night. Nay will be back at 8pm for Nay's Retro Lounge. We'll be continuing with The Simpsons Hit and Run. And then on Friday, we will have a video on the YouTube channel of some kind. So... Until then, follow us on Twitter, Twitter, uh, at Armour Arcade. Follow us on Twitch. Subscribe to us on Twitch. Donate if you want. If you like what we do and you're feeling generous, subscribe to us on YouTube. That's where we put all the VODs and exclusive Friday videos. And um, 
have a really good week. And I'll see you guys next time on the Arcade.